great move. Hello, everybody. It is I, Ethan Klein, with a haircut, and I'm wearing pants as well. <laughs> Who is he? It's Who a new year, a new you. Welcome, Ela. Nice Thank to you. see you. Lovely to have you. <clears throat> it's Friday, baby. Woo! Yep. Yeah. Hope you guys all had a good week. And our, we'll have a great weekend ahead. And let's just get it started. Let's just jump into it right now. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Thank you to Hexclad for sponsoring this uh, episode. Thank you. As well as Teddy Fresh, who uh, the CEO is actually sitting <laughs> beside me. The principal designer, CEO, creative lead. Gila Klein. Sometimes I started to say Gila. Because I feel like... It's e people understand it a lot easier. I know, I know. I know what you mean. Gila. Like a Gila monster. What are those called? But. <laughs> Big ass lizard? Gila. Gila monster. I like it better with the silent A. Gila. Yeah. Yeah. But I know what you mean. Sometimes I don't know how to say it myself when mm -hmm. people ask me what's my name. Yeah. Cause it, I, I'm just like H I L A. Because um, for some reason, the Gila. Is like I think it's because I shouldn't have spelled it like that technically. Even if you don't see the spelling, I don't know. At least for me, when I first heard it, I was like, "What? Like what? I don't understand what what's happening there at the beginning." Yeah. Anyway, here's TeddyFresh.com. We got the here. You want to you want to break it down? So here we have this set where the teddy bear and the splotches are made with bleach, and so it's almost like a stencil, and then they poured bleach. So mm -hmm. they all feel a little different and kind of like not perfect. And then here we wanted to just throw a bunch of teddy bear patches on everything, on the hat and on the set. Love That's it. That's what I'm wearing today. <laughs> this is the lavender color. And here we have the beaded bag, which is so cute. It's beaded. It's made of beads. It's beaded, y'all. And then we made it big enough so you can actually fit, you know, at least like phone, wallet, keys, essentials. That's big? Yeah. Big enough? Cute. And, and there's a necklace, <laughs> I believe. I don't know if you showed yeah, that Yeah, I'm going. Not yet. Okay. Not yet. Here it is. Yes. Is there a close-up of it? Or is that um, that's not here? We have it on Instagram. Here. There you go. I'm wearing that today. Oh, I gotta say, I always say this: the Teddy Fresh there jewelry. Oh, nice, Cam. <laughs> the Teddy Fresh jewelry. I like it is on Cam. So Cam. nice. Mm -hmm. I love it. it. Is always so good. Thank you. It is every time good. Um, and it always people. I think people love it, the jewelry too. It always does really well, and it always looks great. You know. Here it is. Yeah, it's the. Uh... Oh, and this T-shirt also. It's um, so we took a bunch of little charms and bows and we scanned them <laughs> and made a little print out of it. I think it's so cute. There it is. And we're scrolling. Oh, the we're scrolling. That's we're black. scrolling, and yeah. we're done. Teddyfresh.com. Thank you. This is all out today, right now. So uh. Wow, there's just so much to do today. <laughs> you know, it's so much to get to, so much to talk about. Today I, f today I feel, go on, say it. Today I feel uh, gay. Why, because <laughs> I got a haircut? <laughs> I got to say, I love the sides. Mm -hmm. The top is too long. I look like an oblong-shaped hot dog man. Like, I just, I don't like the shape <laughs> of my head. <laughs> a what now? It just, you know, I look like a fucking hot dog. Like, have you ever seen such a cylinder looking head? I like it. Entering glizzy. It's overdrive. too, I like it too. It's just too long on the top. Don't you think? I mean, that's what I do. My hair is just uh, longer than yours. But I think I, maybe you're not used to it. I don't nah, know. it looks weird. What did you think, Ela, when you first saw him? Don't act I, like you didn't agree with me. Now. I, don't so me. I will say, I think it looks very good, but I just, it's just not Ethan. Mm. And I, I kind of like the regular Ethan better. <laughs> Maybe you're used to it. <laughs> I think it would look good just a little off the top. That's Cause my top. You want to do it, Ab? 
I what? trust you. Oh, uh, no, I'm good. Mine, <laughs> I did mine yesterday, and yeah, I'm not really feeling it either. I think it just takes some time to get used to. <laughs> it doesn't look bad. You faded yourself out? I uh, know my barber did. Oh, nice. Yeah. Mm. nice. Which I did have scheduled beforehand, just so everyone knows. Mm-hmm. Not that I, I wouldn't say, have yeah. Yeah. It's Interesting, interesting timing. timing there. Uh, yeah, maybe. yeah. You weren't outside my house today, were you? <laughs> I was not. I actually did want to clarify that uh, from the last episode. Me and Lena were out. We heard about the situation. I went, I don't want to say the business, but I went to the business near your house. And I was waiting there and I texted you guys, everything good. You went to the what? The business near your guys' house. The business in our house? Near your house. Oh, a bit. you went to a business near our house? Yes. Okay. Um, but yeah, and I was texting you guys saying, you good? Should I, I could pull up? I don't mind. And you guys are like, no, no, it's okay. So I respected your guys' when privacy. When was this? What happened? I know, Ab. Yeah. I know. I'm. I love what he said when the Cody thing was going down. Jeff's oh, friend, that. who's oh. now my best friend, by the way. If you watched, I was on Probably. Jeff's show gotcha. yesterday. No, I didn't get to watch it. We have really good rapport, me and Cody. <laughs> We're actually united against <laughs> Jeff now. I saw you guys were very silly together. <laughs> yeah, that was funny. He got, he got bought me a Coke. Oh. Yeah, Coke Zero. Okay. Mm-hmm. What a guy. Cute. He is really nice, actually, when he's mm-hmm. not threatening and stalking. He's super nice. Um, and he told me all about jail because he's apparently like a three-time felon. Wow. Non-violent. Okay. Non-violent felon. Now expunged. Okay. Now expunged. Of course. Though. Yeah. So okay. clean record. Him, Jeff, too. They both got expunged. They can vote. Everybody deserves a clean, a clean start. I didn't know you could do that. And then, I, well, my question is, after you get expunged, can yeah. you get expunged again? Because it seems like a loophole. Is that the word, like sponge? Expunged. <laughs> I actually don't know how it's spelled, but I know that's... But, um, so I didn't know that was brought up, but I remember, A.B., Here, the expunged. conversation. It was very nice of you. Oh, thank you. So Yeah. Yeah, I kind of made it seem like I was just outside the house <laughs> with binoculars. <laughs> I wasn't that night, maybe another night, but not that night. Um, that was before you were hired. Yeah, that was before I was hired. <laughs> but uh, no, I was just, uh, I don't know, it was just a weird situation. It was all happening it was so very fast. Weird. Yeah, so, <laughs> so I didn't know God. if it was one guy or five guys. Uh, yeah, not that I could have really very... done anything. I'd have to hit him with the car, but yeah. I appreciated that. It's you know. nice to feel like there's somebody <laughs> with you, you know? It was like, Absolutely. I got you guys if mm-hmm. you need. He can come, run in, distract him, I'll leave. Yeah. <laughs> I'll call the police, you know. Um, I've got to defend myself a little bit here. What I guess happened? people are saying, oh, Ethan, doxing again. Okay, it was just a joke, guys. We are just doing a silly fun. Don't game. say this game pin on the screen out loud. Ryan. Okay. People don't. Seven, so people five, don't three. <laughs> Seven, five, three. Two, seven, three, zero. One person in I there. thought one of them would react, uh, but then I just let it linger. I you have think. to let it linger. <laughs> and then people go, I thought Ethan was joking, but he was deaf reading it out loud. I think saying fake numbers would have stumped himself. Like, come on, bro. You think, what, I can't chew bubble gum and walk at the same time? <laughs> <laughs> what level of functionality do you think I have? Oh my god. <laughs> I will continually well be underestimated by fans <laughs> yeah. and foes alike. Yeah. yeah so I that don't know but, if Ethan knows his numbers, <laughs> to be honest. But it was fun. I love Jeff. Love Cody. Love his whole team. They mm-hmm. had very nice things to say. They're they they like what we do. They're fans? They're all inspired. That's cool. Lots of accolades to you guys. I love the origin story. It's all very cool. Whose origin story? <laughs> of this friendship. Oh, with me Jeff. and Jeff. Yeah, it's pretty wild. It all started it on this wild. crazy interview when he called in. Listen, he's he, he's a good like, guy. It, it was he just got caught moment. up in the middle of some really fucked up stuff and with friends mm-hmm. that really didn't look out for him. Mm-hmm. You know. Yeah. Yeah, it was crazy though. Do you remember like the views? It was like one hundred and sixty thousand or something like that. Oh, okay. was it? It was. Holy shit. It was crazy. Dude, Frenemies was nuts. <laughs> that that was that that was a phenomenon like I don't even know. 160,000? <laughs> that's what I remember. Poor Jeff. Somebody I mean, I think it was me, but I'm pretty there, sure yeah. that that's what it was. <laughs> Poor Jeff. I was I mean, like, school yeah. watching live, I remember it. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah. yeah. That was in the library. <laughs> oh, oh my god. god. Is that right? I've never mm-hmm. sank into my chair lower than I did when 
because I, I was there switching because we were yeah. still doing it in the basement at the yeah. time. <laughs> and when that whole thing was going on, I was just like, oh my God, this is so comfortable. <laughs> <laughs> this is so bad. Well, he told me uh, they, they have drops there of the OK, Ethan, and they also have the... Uh, <laughs> Uh, I don't know. They were they had drops of him uh, yeah. struggling through that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. But um, uh. but um, bum. I also yesterday. This is important to get out. Go ahead. You want to say? I'm something? just wondering where is Duck Duck. He's I right think, here. Oh, okay. Okay. Cool. <laughs> Duckius Maximus. <laughs> um, I had a really fun adventure yesterday. I had to cut off. Jeff's podcast at three to go do a fecal sample. Yeah. It's so embarrassing. Like when you go to the front, I don't like saying it. I go, I'm here to do a drop off. (laughs) (laughs) But then they they get confused. I'm here to make a deposit. (laughs) They get confused. They go, oh, you're dropping off. Okay. And then then they think I like shit at home and brought it. And then I go, no, I don't have it with me. And need to provide a live sample. Yeah. They go, oh, it's called a fresh sample. I was like, gross. (laughs) (laughs) So the first place I went to, they were like, we're like, okay, well, here's like 20 different pieces. I wish I brought it. Mm. Is it in the car? No, I took it out. Fuck. God, I wish I had it. I'd show you guys. No, because she's like, you need to go home. Shit, and, there, and last time I did it, it was just one cup, like a urine sample cup type of cup. And it was disgusting, but you just put it in one cup, you move on mm-hmm. with your life. Mm-hmm. This time they had me a bag with five different cups. Three of them have tiny little narrow entrances. I've, I am not kidding when I tell you it's this narrow. Okay. You can imagine the... That's not okay. Well, anyway, she's like, so you need to go home, shit in all five of these, and then if you want to bring it back, like, tomorrow, you have to refrigerate. I says, I'm not putting my shit in my refrigerator. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm not doing <laughs> it. <laughs> I don't Get care with what the it's food. filled in. I don't yeah. care if it's, you know, hermetically, is that her, hermetic? Hermetic? Hermetically sealed. Hermetically sealed with fucking hard. NASA technology. It's not going in my refrigerator. No. You gotta throw the yeah. fridge out after that. Yeah. So, so Lena was able to call and get, because last time I did it there, and that's what I thought I was doing. And frankly, just to be totally honest with you guys, I was holding in, a, I had the shit, and I was holding it in all day. Right. You were talking about holding it in from the day before already. Because unlike most people, I cannot control when I poop. Mm. It just, it's out of my control. So being able to know, like, I've got one loaded up mm. in the chamber, <laughs> one in the cannon. Locked and loaded. Oh. That's not something that happens at every opportunity for me. This was a carefully organized plan. And so Lena was able to call. Um, you, want, you could take that part, Lena. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it. <laughs> well, so... Just don't violate my HIPAA rights. Of course, of course. <laughs> So you went to the other lab where you can do the stool sample there yourself, and you couldn't find it though. I don't know how to explain this part because oh, I, yeah, this I couldn't thing. figure out how to explain it to you like in any other way. I hate when this happens. When well, anyway, Lena called and she got me. A, she got me to a walk in for the okay, and it was real close. So I raced over there, and they're like, "You have to be there before two forty-five." Right? Or 345? Yeah. 345? It was 445. 445? Mm-hmm. What the fuck? Mm-hmm. Took so damn long. I left at 3, you know? Mm-hmm. And um, I go up to the second floor, <clears throat> and the instructions they gave Lena is just on the second floor. I says, okay, well, there's, you know, there's like eight different offices. There's radiology, there's oncology. There's no there's- sweet number? There are sweet numbers, but they didn't tell Lena the sweet number. They just said second floor. There's oh, shit so, all on the But they were explaining is that the lab is just on the second floor. But okay, well, you know, because... uh, the lab is in, <laughs> you know, Los Angeles. Uh, <laughs> you got to be been, more specific. You've been there before, right? I have been there before, but there's different offices, and I've done blood work in, like, the oncology part. So the first place I went to was the oncology part, and it says, hey, um... I don't know if this is the right place, but uh, I need to uh, 
we have to shit here. I need to uh There's shit all over the floor. Do a drop off. <laughs> <laughs> and they're like, you're, you're, we, are you with um, UPS? And, uh, <laughs> what are you dropping off? What, what are you dropping off? I have to drop off a stool <laughs> sample. <laughs> then they recoil in horror. <laughs> and they go, I don't think that was us. I said, okay. <laughs> then I, I get embarrassed. So I go, okay, let me go to radiology. Because, I mean, I know it's not them. But I say, <laughs> I say, is there, because so I was running out of time. <laughs> And, and this I is didn't. Like 440 right now. Yeah. yeah. Oh god. So I was like, listen, I know it's probably not you guys, but I need to take a shit in a fucking <laughs> thing and have people. So where would you think I would do that? <laughs> and then they told me to try two ten. Mm. So I go to two ten. <laughs> oh, yeah, they love shit over there. And then I tell them, <laughs> and she's <laughs> like, I don't know what you. She's, I don't know what you're talking about. Oh. Let me go ask back in the back. But she went asked in the back, and they figured it out, and they brought me. So they oh, brought me Jesus. the same setup, though. Yeah, like everyone oh, in the God. building knows you're there to take a giant <laughs> shot. It's disgusting. <laughs> also, I just want to mention, I also called the representative there to ask them, like, how I could give you better directions. And they kept emphasizing just second floor. And he didn't know what else <laughs> to tell me. It's not that, I promise you, it's not that easy. <laughs> you walk in and there's just, there's tons of departments. The second you know? <laughs> And then you asked the receptionist, and she also told you she didn't know what you're talking about. At first, she did, <laughs> but then she's like, "Let me check in back at, at the right at the whatever the the office two ten, the infamous two ten. <laughs> I'm glad you ended up making it though. Me That's too. Good. Yeah. <laughs> Can you imagine having to do all that, like shitting at your house? And it wasn't close to my house either. It's like an hour drive. <laughs> drive with that in the car. It's like a bio oh, no. weapon. Imagine getting pulled over. Explain that one. I'm getting in an accident. You shut down the whole shit freeway. everywhere. Yeah. So they gave me a, the same thing with the two urine-sized cups and then the three tiny little test tubes. That's not okay. And so, what are you supposed to do? What okay, are so, you supposed to so do? So let me tell you. For the big ones, it's the same as last time. There's just like a you know the the wood stick the doctor puts on your tongue. Yeah. He goes, ah, so you have one of those for scooping oh. <laughs> into the big one, no. which is funny. fine. There's a, sure. there's a big hole. It's a big stick. Uh -huh. It's disgusting. It's yeah. vile, but it's it doable. Logistically is OK. 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 Right. But then you get into these little test tubes. And what happens is you unscrew it and connected to the top of the lid is a tiny spoon. Mm. 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 So you need to scoop it. And there's there's liquid in the tube and they say filled to this line. So you take a little scoop of shit. And by the way, it's a oh tiny spoon. God. So scooping with a tiny spoon out of a shit is not easy. It yeah. takes yeah. some yeah. effort. Yeah. Yeah. Thing. I sent you a photo of the picture you took yesterday when you texted oh, us good. and you're like, I'm in. <laughs> oh yeah, I just told you. I wanted Lena to know that I had made it to the bathroom with everything. <laughs> Moments before disaster. <laughs> yeah, here's the small ones. Uh, and it's the size of the small ring here. Yeah. Do you see yeah. how small that is? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> so maybe I can find a photo of the Seems... try to find a photo of the stool sample with the tiny spoon under the lid. And so there's a little liquid in it, and it says fill to this line. Yeah. So you put a little shit in there. It's Dude, vile. Yeah, and then, you know, frankly, and this is so disgusting that they that this is what happens, but you have to like you know, like like you're putting cream cheese back in, like extra cream cheese. Mm -hmm. You know, you have to like slide it on the wall. There's no other way to get it out. Is it this? I think I found it. Yeah, it's basically that. I found uh, this one looks more like a fork. Mine had spikes for some yeah, reason on it. It's this spikes. one. I think. <laughs> it's a spork. It. It's literally a little <laughs> it was, spork. Yeah, it was, it's like a tulip. Oh my god. It was. That is I mean, so yeah. Stupid. Essentially. <laughs> There's oh no God. better I mean, way to adorable. do that. <laughs> I feel like this is a refined design. I feel like they know what they're doing with this. That looks like someone cut it in the back. Hmm. Those edges <laughs> shoddy, are not clipped. Shoddy prison. workmanship. That's a prison <laughs> shank right there. Right. So anyway, I had to do three of these. That's not okay. And there's and the thing is like, you know, somebody's gonna have to like, in the lab, they take it out and do all the. But there's shit all over the top and all over the floor. There's right. shit all over the floor. There it is. And it's probably the most disgusting thing I've ever had to do in my life. I think it was. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Imagine. <laughs> oh. Oh. It took a while, too. It was just five samples. 
you're scooping. <laughs> uh-huh. You got sticks, you got tiny spoons. Yeah. And then you have a bucket of shit because you had to put a fucking shit catcher in the toilet, shit in it, take it out of the toilet, <laughs> and then scoop from the bathroom floor. No bucket is required. <laughs> and last oh, time they I gave. I was wondering, okay, I was wondering where the main load. <laughs> <laughs> was being kept. Bucket is required. It's in the butt. So it's like the pesto thing. You remember what the pesto yeah. is in? It's like that. Jake oh Doolittle, do you really God. want to tell me that I'm faking illness, you freak? Have you not seen my pesto shit? Oops. Exactly. Never let that go. So, and then last time they gave me like a big garbage bag for all the dirty shit. This time they didn't do it. I don't know if they forgot. So I dumped the excess shit in the toilet. But you still have like a Garbage. You still have like a receptacle with shit on the side all over it. Yeah. And a spoon with shit all over it. Yeah. And so there was, there was like a relatively small trash can in the bathroom that I was forced to Piece smash shit. it down in. There was nowhere else to put it. Piece of shit. I wanted to be clean and hygienic <laughs> and do the right thing. Yeah. So I just put it face down and just forced it down there. Yeah, I guess. I guess. Get on me! Yeah, and then you have to do a walk of shame. I will go over there with like a whole fucking <laughs> collection of turds to the lab to drop it off. They go, oh, you just put it there. I says, on the counter? They says, no, in the sink. I think the only thing worse if, is if the receptionist is like, wait, are you Ethan Klein? <laughs> I think, to be honest with you, the receptionist may have known who oh, I was. Oh, no. Because there was a slight glimmer of recognition. <laughs> they're professionals, right? Because they're in healthcare. They yeah. Have to but there was a slight smile and recognition. <laughs> I felt a glint when I walked up. And I was like, here we go. I have to uh, drop off a sample. God shit on me! She's like, okay, you brought it with you. I said, no. <laughs> well, in a sense, yes, but uh, it's inside of me still. <laughs> oh, then the, uh, the first place I went to, by the way, they go, um, they go, uh, we're not equipped for that. The one that was <laughs> telling me you have to do it at home. She's like, we don't have the bathrooms equipped for that. And I was like, okay, whatever. And so when she was done explaining and gave me everything, I said, can I use the restroom? Because I had to pee really bad. And she's like, yeah, but... Not for that, right? <laughs> I'm not sneak a shit in their bathroom. <laughs> After she told me not to. I ran home real quick. <laughs> Come out of the bathroom. Here you go. I ran home. They thought you were going to trick them. <laughs> okay, he's chewing a toy. But for the record, that bathroom was definitely set up for it. Like, mm. they had it. It was looked identical. What, is, how much set up you need? What does that mean? Like, well, you're not going to be set up at home either. Whatever that means. Yeah. I don't know what it means. It's not set up for <laughs> they shitting. They just didn't want you to do it. Yeah, yeah, they, they had to they're like, oh boy. You. Maybe if I looked nicer or like less gross, they would have been like, go ahead. Yeah, <laughs> but you're they're like, like this guy. You and, got the fade. Uh, I got the fade. Maybe that's why. I'm actually looking. I might get the um. Last time I did the turd sample, they gave me the results the next day morning. Mm. So I'm looking. Bag of turd. I uh, maybe I'll get it during the show. That would be exciting. <laughs> But it was five samples this time, so yeah. clearly there's, there's we're focusing in. Mm-hmm. What's the title? David Dobrik calls out Jason Nash. Ben Shapiro drops rap song. Are we liking the David Dobrik? Are we feeling yeah. the pull of that? Yeah. We're vibing on that one. Yeah, yeah. I am, I hate to say enjoying because it is tragic, uh, truly. But Jason's just, his deterioration as a respectable human being, if he ever was that, I mean, don't, don't mince my words here, people. Um, and, <laughs> and then David's like absolute lack of empathy and care for his friend. Yeah. Who help, was there with him the way up. Yeah. He was with him. You're supposed to take your homies with you, you know? My whole, as soon as here, got a whole make it and the whole crew's here. What's that Drake song? <sighs> Started from the bottom and we're here. Right. Started from the bottom and the whole crew's here. I need the Max Wayne. Yeah. All yeah. the N words are here, mm-hmm. probably, something like that. Congratulations. I completely agree with you. It makes no sense. And, and David's always, like living fat. That's always been one of our criticisms of David. It's like he's like 
having everybody be there, use them. No payment. No payment. No insurance. Well, what is that? No safety. Mm -mm. But the thing is, you know, of all the people on the so-called vlog squad, everybody's trying to do their own thing. Jason, he was his guy. Mm. You know. I'm yeah. sorry. What is that? <laughs> you finally <laughs> are finally. That. Oh my god. I mean, I've it's heard been like it. like 2 weeks. But I I mean, it's Drake. Oh, it is? Yeah. I'm sorry. Is that a uh <laughs> It's from the Anita Max. I need a Max Ween. Anita Max Ween. That's funny. He was doing these like uh, Congratulations. <laughs> I'm sorry. He's such a freak with the gambling shit. It's oh funny though. That's god. the problem. Yeah. It's he's this this dude. He's on stake, yeah. selling gambling, yeah. and this motherfucker has the balls to <laughs> sell merch with a little, I guess, Character. Hispanic looking woman. Anita Maxween. Is yep. that out of pocket? That's what it is. No. He does the accent too, <laughs> and her name is Anita Maxween. Anita Maxween. Oh. He goes Anita Maxween. Oh my and god. And he's selling a hat. Oh my what? God. He's selling merch now about <laughs> his gambling uh, sponsorship. This it's dude like, has a layers of earnings. Yeah, he's made like a persona <laughs> of his gambling addiction. It's great. Wow. I need a Max Ween. It's funny though. That's I the need thing. A Max Ween. Oh, I'm. Is it? I here that? here. This is Anita Max Ween. Huh. I guess I don't know where Hispanic came from. I'm sorry. He's definitely doing it. The accent yeah. that he's doing. Yeah. Okay. Good. Well. Yeah. The, the, I'm sorry and congratulations is separate. I kind of like it too. That's what's fucked. Like the design is so dumb, but it's kind of vibes, right? The layout's not bad. And it's so oh dumb. Um, I think it is dumb. I don't know. You do. I don't think it crosses. I'm not, I would not wear this dumb. hat. I would not wear this hat. Dumb. I think it says steak on one side of it. If I'm not mistaken. Oh yeah, I noticed that too. It says <laughs> steak. What the fuck are we doing out here? We're selling merch? Oh my God. Golly. Gee willikers, man. Jiminy Cricket. Oh, some people think it sounds Filipino. I honestly don't know. <laughs> okay, well, some it's some some sort of an accent yeah. that he's trying to do. So, what's the line, by the way, uh, Ab? He does not say all the n words are here. So let's issue a retraction and a correction. Uh, you know what the n word is? Exact one, just to be hundred percent. Started sure. from the bottom, and we're here. All right, I'm gonna. Started from the bottom, now we're here. Started from the My whole bottom, bottom of the whole crew. Yeah. My whole fucking team? That's not what he Crew. says. No. Is that what you're saying he says? Yeah, now my whole fucking team here. Mm. Uh, yeah. Whole, yeah. Started from the bottom, now the whole fucking team is here. Alright, after after the okay, one of the lines he said team here. And then he says the N-word, so. Mm. So there is an N-word. I mean, which is good. It's his right. It's his right as you're it's so his privilege. Weird, man. The N word. <laughs> what? It's like you're so weird. Why? <laughs> what do you mean by that, Dan? So, uh, what the fuck? Fun fact. You're so weird. What are you, my mom? <laughs> you're so weird. It's a weird thing to say. It's a funny thing to say, Dan. <laughs> All right. It's funny. And that is, room. if you didn't know, my job. This is the connection we share. True. Mm. Pritch. It's your privilege to, you know, shit on me, and and you acknowledge, <laughs> and you do that, and you do do that. <laughs> fair, fair enough. Fair enough. Half <laughs> Jewish. <clears throat> um. Anyway, let's see. Uh, that was a whole lot of, a lot of this and that. <laughs> uh, people want you to go to a volcano, Dan. I love that idea. To throw a Stanley <laughs> Cup I in. I love that idea too. Yeah. I love it. Let's let's go. Sure. I'll make that sacrifice. Well, I had pitched because the <laughs> barbecue flames were not hot enough to pierce mm. the Stanley blood barrier. Yeah. There's lead in that cup. Did you know that? I heard you guys talk yeah. about it. It's worth mentioning. <laughs> Why it tastes so good. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so I had mentioned that Dan should go to Hawaii and throw it in a volcano. I mean, okay, sounds fun, yeah. People want awesome. him to enjoy a Hawaiian vacation. This is a great idea. The question is... Can you actually get to the top of a volcano and get that shot? Like, is that actually I don't think you need to get to the top of a volcano because there are just lava flows. Now, that yeah. said, um, there's... I mean, is it, like, polluting to throw um, it in lava? Am I polluting the lava? 
Let's talk. You well, know what I mean? Is that just, I, I like, mean, it's a I genu- I'm cup. asking genuinely. Like, I don't believe so because, like, that's how the just, earth recycles itself. It literally it flows under the crust of another plate. 100. percent I, I, yeah, I'm unsure if just I, I'm wondering I if people you would be that mad that you're throwing things into. Well, well, we have to remove it. That's part of the experiment. It's got to be attached to some kind of hmm. a, uh, a drone. So, so you put it. So this would actually take a little bit of like. We'll have to consult with a scientist, like, geologist. Yeah, right, like somebody who actually knows what they're so, doing. So, like, if we could find a lava flow, an active lava flow, and a geologist that we could work with, where we can reasonably put the Stanley Cup in the lava flow, why are we doing marketing for them? They should be paying us. Like, this is crazy <laughs> as, you know. Mm-hmm. Well, you, well, you, we, you maybe were we doubting their marketing. That. That's why it all started, was that you thought you were calling them out. But so far, they've been passing the tests. I don't know. Look, all I know is you don't fuck getting all superstitious here you don't fuck with the hawaiian volcanoes what what's the superstition about that <laughs> like, like, the god, hold on hear me out hear that's, me all out. Knows. that's a new one the goddess pele uh-huh you've what? ever heard if you take lava rocks from hawaii then bad luck comes upon you you've so you put it no i've actually, never heard that okay you can search it it's it's actual it's a um well where, where did so you learn that superstitions aside I, my volcanoes. concern was more of just like it yeah i mean like going to hawaii and just throwing stuff. Well, you're thinking well, about like the ecological, the, both the ecological the and, like, and the cultural. Like Native Hawaiians might and not Pele. like us fucking and and Pele, which I guess is part of that. Um, you know, Wait, but if we're but, not actually yeah, even exactly. putting it into the lava, well, we're, we're not just, taking any rocks from Hawaii. We're we're depositing. We will take no rocks. I'm I'm not accusing. I'm just saying. We're just, just don't fuck with that shit. Off. You just don't fuck <laughs> with it. We're dropping off a sample. Apparently, it's illegal to take lava rocks from Hawaii. It's also considered bad luck, known as Pele's curse. There you go. Taking lava rocks from the island is said to bring bad luck and misfortune upon the thief. Why? Okay, nobody wants your lava rocks anyway. Why can't you, don't you take fuck a with rock? Pele. It's so cool. Like, I'm just thinking, if we went there with Theodore, you would probably want to take a rock. Also, it's like you bring in all these tourists here. It's like a tourist destination. you got all these hotels. you got all these people. Oh, but don't take the rocks. But if Well, is, not everybody wants yeah. all those tourists there, I think. There, the, there's uh, people. That's being that go, there. I guarantee you, however, the locals, yes. However, the economy, the local economy, the government, and all those people, they live on tourism. I'm just saying yeah, there's, no, it's there's a necessary there's, part of there, their economy. There's stories that people take the rocks, they actually mail it back to Hawaii because the, the, the bad luck is so bad. <laughs> Whoa. So, so I'm seeing what? that some Hawaiians believe wow. uh, they view the rocks as their ancestors, so it's disrespectful. Wow. Okay, that them. makes sense because yeah. I, didn't, I didn't understand, like, what's the deal? And when people go there, do, are they being told not to do it? Do people know that? I think so. Yeah. Okay. I've never heard that. I've, I've never been. So but I've never been know. up to a volcano yeah, either in Hawaii. Maybe, maybe. maybe that's, you know, different vibes. The There's the so many team. rocks. There's so many of them. Just, you know what I mean? I mean, everybody says that, and then every, you know, 100 <laughs> years pass, and there there ain't no rocks anymore. Okay, check this out, Dan. So we can get close to a lava flow. Yeah, yeah. So, I think just, like, mm-hmm. interacting with it, you would definitely want, like, a geologist that knows what they're doing to uh, assist in that. So I would, I think I would be okay with this idea, Dan, if um, we can basically organize it, like I said, we need a geologist, we need a plan, and we need a plan to get it out and some plan to measure the inside of it. Mm-hmm. And if we can actually get a, a legitimate plan, I will send you and and uh, Ali, who is there for emotional support. To film. Yeah. yeah. I'll do it. Fuck it. Okay. I'll do it. Well, uh, if you uh, live in Hawaii or, uh, or I guess just anywhere where there's an active volcano, I mean, that's just the first thing that comes to mind. True. There could be active volcanoes that are not, are, are in the continental. Uh, it would be States. good to have a local person guide us to make sure we're not doing anything disrespectful. True. I'm just saying, Dan, I want you to get a Hawaii trip. I, there's, it's not a good idea. I'm not taking the rock. He's not. We're not I taking get it. the no, rock. I'm not Zach. taking any rock. That's just, a bad just, idea. Just Wait. disturbing it. Zach, I'm just not, going to Hawaii is disturbing? Just being, just Zach, no, fucking interacting with the, with the lava? Fuck, fucking with the lava. I'm just saying, you I'm know, just saying. I'm warning you. Yeah. You know, not to ruin anything for you, Dan, but we could make lava at home. You can make lava. You can melt <laughs> rock. I mean, that that would actually, be that's interesting. That would Dan. definitely be cheaper. Well, let's maybe just send you to a smelter locally yeah. in LA. That sounds That'd fun, fun too. Ali can come fun to Hawaii, but that <laughs> would be interesting. <laughs> okay, let's do that. Let's start with that. <laughs> Sorry, Dan. <done. laughs> let's look up a yeah, blacksmith thanks, here that's in great. LA. But it wouldn't be as fun for Dan unless. I mean, the lava flow is pretty epic. Yeah. 
I'm somewhat skeptical that we can arrange this in a responsible way. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah People are saying Iceland. That's true. There are many. Uh, Iceland's far as shit. What the mm. hell? But Iceland's true. cool, man. You want to go fuck with the Iceland volcano? That's cool. <laughs> uh, you know what would be the best, Dan? If you bring back a rock and then secret, somehow secretly gift it to Zach. Yeah, put it in his house. <laughs> like, give, buy him like a little ukulele and then tape yeah, yeah. a rock inside. Right. I'm saying. Don't even tell uh, him. I'm. I've heard horror stories about this. I'm just warning you guys. Okay. Yeah, it's just looking well, out for I, you guys. Well, out of respect for uh, other people's cultures and uh, and faith, I will not touch any rocks. But also, I'm not too concerned about upsetting Pele. No, Pele's not going to be upset because we're not doing anything disrespectful. Yeah. By the way, we got, so I don't know if you guys heard, there's like a new Subway foot long snack thing going on. So I've always been wanting to try it. Oh, is that here? We did a big order and they canceled with us. It was just horrible. Okay, it was so just a nightmare. This is a chore? Mm hmm. Okay. Mm. There's three items mm -hmm. in total. <laughs> it's, that's a bad churro. Mm -hmm. Okay, first. There's not enough um, sugar on it. At first, you get that nice cinnamon flavor, but when you get to the middle, you're like, that's just bread. Mm -hmm. He's eating bread stick. Yeah. Uh-uh. Oh, everyone got... That's, this is a pass. That's actually really not a good one. Don't eat that churro, you guys. Bad? I didn't really? like it at all. You want to try it? You know what pissed me off, too, in their marketing? They're like, a foot long churro. It's a foot long. A churro is a foot it's, long they're minimum. They're always long, yeah. Minimum. True. Long churros that is small not, churro. That's a small churro. That's not impressive. And apparently Bread it's stick. not good either, so. Not good. Not mm. good. What is even, what am I looking at? That's a pretzel? Yeah. It's a pretzel stick. It looks it fucked up. It looks like a looks lobster. looks like a worm or, yeah, some it sort of crustacean. Like no, yeah. that looks good. It's Hell not no. good, though. I promise. No? So it's and a, I love pretzel. It's supposed wow. to be an Auntie Anne's pretzel. And... <laughs> <laughs> The uh -huh. churro is Cinnabon collab. Dude, that's collab. They're dropping the ball, dude. Is this the cookie? This is what I'm really concerned about, is the foot okay, long cookie. So this, this is definitely the star. A this foot star long now. cookie. Okay. Yeah. As you know, Subway has great cookies. Nobody denies that. Huh. Wow. That looks good. Yeah. Gray, no Surprise less. very good. Dude. Okay, should I dump, maybe dump it out? Ooh. So, Why dump it? it out? No, eat it from the tray. I'll put it back like in. Like a pig. Look. Okay. <laughs> That's so stupid. <laughs> From the middle? That's psycho. That's psycho that behavior. Psycho. Right psycho. in the middle. <laughs> Bro. All right, I'm, I'm trying. I'm eating from the end, though. Let me, let, let me try that cookie. Mm. So, here's what I'll say. The cookie is... Oh, my God. Not bad. It's mm -hmm. pretty good. However, the cookies, the cookie cookies are better. Because mm. it doesn't get um, crispy around the edges. No. With yeah, this. it's all kind of soft. It's very soft. Wow, that's it's good though. It's good. Mm -hmm. That's really mushy. Yeah. It's like no crisp at all. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah. This Some people not... like it like that. So if you like mm -hmm. it a little undercooked. No, no, no. It's I, not... mm -mm. I'm one of those, but I like it to be still crispy on the outside. Me too. Me too. This mm. isn't one of those. This is just a yeah. Churros a flop. Dude, that churro yeah, sucks. I'm gonna try it right now, but yeah, I don't have high hopes. It has like no cinnamon or sugar on yeah. it. Yeah. It's just it's just a piece of bread. Yeah. It's oh, like give me a break. Bread stick. Give me a break. The bread yeah, stick right? is probably the worst item. I want to try the churro yeah. too. Here you want to try? What did you tell the, the worst churro? Shit the bread done since Jerry. No, that was the the churro tasted like a bread stick. Right. The pretzel tastes more like That's anything. Fucked up. The pretzel. All right. The pretzel was the worst one, I think. <gasps> it's so. Did you try it? Yeah, I love it. What? Yeah. yeah. I love pretzel bread. All right. I'm not going to hate. I've got one. I respect your decision. Thank you. Maybe your pretzel is better than mine. Mm -hmm. Ricky says, You guys want a good churro? Go to Don Churro Gomez in Anaheim. They have a just a straight up churro shop. I've never heard of that. I've been to, not that one, but I've been to a, like places that specialize in churros. Yeah, now, I fucking love churros, man. What do you think about the pretzel? S tier. Um, I didn't... B tier. Like, <clears throat> not a great pretzel, but I I'd eat it. I like it. it. Okay, D the, the, churro, the churro is like a massive miss. That's like yes. F tier for me. But this, like, I'd eat this if I was hungry. I think the cookies are C. 
No, the cookie the, fucks. The, the, the cookie's better the cookie. than It's not the cookie's better, better than, than their than... normal cookies. Oh. It's no, best this is out of like the a, three, though. Like cookie cake. I mean, listen, Hello. it's a cookie. Of course it's going to taste good. Yeah. True. It's got chocolate. You know what I mean? Hmm. I wouldn't so, recommend any of these. Um, we have somebody, Melanie. But yeah. You see that? Yeah. <laughs> Melanie says, went to Hawaii for vacation and took home a rock. My mom broke her foot, the fridge broke, and my dog got sick within the week of coming home. That's Zach, tough. thoughts? I'm just saying those are the stories I've heard. Hmm. Scary. Well, Who is Pele? I'm glad we learned this today because I have never heard that until Pe now. Pele is the goddess of uh, Hawaii. Oh, so she don't she don't fuck with people taking her rock. And it's crazy, like sometimes people see her in the fire, like they see mm. the yeah. probably the fumes. <laughs> probably. <laughs> Guys, why not find a blacksmith forge <laughs> and a sensor that will record the inter internal temperature? To an SD card and then analyze the results afterwards by plotting a graph. That's what I want to do. Do you know how to do that? <laughs> because I we needed some. Science. I mean, I'm sure we could figure it out. How hard could it be? <laughs> <clears throat> I mean, probably not that hard, right? I mean, it's doable. You've done more complicated stuff. Yeah, I was serious. We could probably yeah. figure it out. Um, Le Lena, Lena said uh, a fissure erupted on Iceland just a couple of weeks ago. Okay. Right. Wonderful. You don't want to fly there now. <laughs> it's probably a bad time. <laughs> or a great time. Is that the volcano Perfect with time. like the super long name? You know what I'm talking about? It erupted a few years back. In Iceland? Yeah. I think they have volcanoes erupting pretty much continuously. There was one that erupted with this long ass name. I'm pretty sure they're always under threat of like all dying. Yeah, there was a whole village that had to be evacuated. There was a big ass crack through the whole oh, city. Oh shit. Mm -hmm. It's kind of crazy. It's very crazy. That said, shout out to Iceland. You guys want to know I've what always I got? wanted to visit there too. Iceland I'd be happy with beautiful. Iceland. Yeah, beautiful. This is my healthy Subway sandwich. I got turkey, mm -hmm. pepper, spinach, yeah. jalapeno, pepperoncinis. Nice. Um, what else is in here? I guess that's it. And then mayonnaise and salt and pepper. Uh, Scott just donated five dollars and said, "I'm a tour guide on the Big Island of Hawaii, the island with the active volcano. I would love to take you guys to the volcano." Mm. Scott, email. So email me. That's good. That's a start. I want. We should probably consult with the. An ecologist as well, a geologist, ecologist, and a kind of scientist. And well, a somebody local. who works on that kind of stuff, maybe they have connections. To yeah, that, I hope so. so. We can we can open a dialogue here. And meanwhile, if you oh, Just, if you operate a forge or a blacksmith, also reach out. Right. I just I don't know if they have enough knowledge about dropping a Stanley Cup into the volcano and how the goddess would feel about that. Yeah, the goddess, we didn't get her thoughts on Stanley mm -hmm. Cups being... So if there's somebody that... But it is a weird gray zone, isn't it? Because it's like, you can't... Don't take the rocks. Okay, fair enough. But what about dipping what about something a drop in off? it and then... But it's like, I'm not even leaving it. And we're just dipping it in the lava. Right. A dip off. It's a dip. Well, does she... we take a dip in, in the lava? In my is opinion, it's too much? totally fine. I guess we'll like, see. Leaving see it in say. there, I think, would be fine, technically. But we're not even doing that. We're taking it back How out. How do you take right. it back out? You got to attach something to it. Yeah, we'd have to. Made of what? I'm sure there's some kind of metal yeah. that has a super high melting point. I mean, I've seen lots of videos where like geologists are doing studies on it and collecting samples from it and stuff. So mm. that's what I'm saying. If we get if we get a hold of the right person, I feel like there is definitely a method. Um, uh -huh. I agree. And then if it survives that, then we're just gonna have to throw it in like a nuclear reactor or something, <laughs> shoot it into the sun. <laughs> That'd be sick. Not really sure. <laughs> All right, that's exciting. My uh, best friend lives in Iceland. She may have some lava intel. Oh, good. Oh. Lives in Iceland. Your best friend lives in Iceland. Did she yeah. move there? Uh, she did. She married someone who is Icelandic. Mm. Does she like it there? Or she hate it. She loves it. Um, I've been there too. It's like my favorite place in the world. Really? Yeah, it's awesome. Do you go during night or day? No, we didn't go during that season. But <laughs> it's the best. 
during the Highly summer recommend. and the winter, it's day and night all the time. That's crazy. Right? Mm, almost. Uh, it's not basically. Like yeah. That. The further north you go, the it's more. It's pretty wild way to yeah. live. I would love to visit a place like that. Lowest crime in the world. Also, there's other good things about Iceland that's interesting. They have all kinds of interesting stuff happening there. They have the Blue Lagoon. Super mm -hmm. cool. Do you like, think they have um do you think they have vampire problems there? Like in that movie? Oh, vampires are from Iceland? That's news to me. Well, no, just because they have six months of night. Yeah, it'd be <laughs> the worst place. Oh, but then yeah, but then they have to hibernate like right. for a whole right. I guess it evens Dumb. out. It's the blood of God. It's just that it's so concentrated. It's like six months straight of these guys. I just, I don't know how long they can hibernate, like, mm -hmm. before they need to eat. Do you mm. think when it's night for 24 hours straight, they need to, like, sleep? Or are they just, like, up and doing their thing? I think they're, they're cleaning, they're watching TV. Yeah. <laughs> Depends what kind of vampires. If they're, like, sexy vampires, like Cullens, then they're chilling. Right. What about um, serial killers? Do we have any of those over there? I don't think so. No. I, Lowest I crime mean, in the maybe. world. Anywhere in the world, mm -hmm. I think. Iceland serial killer. Um, yeah. The, no there's, results. There's one. He was known as the only serial killer in the history of Iceland. <laughs> His name was... Uh, Bjorn. Bjorn. I don't have <laughs> It's Bjorn. 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 What was Bjorn uh, I also deal? see he lived uh, from 1555 to 1596. Holy shit. What? They gone like 600 years without a... Serial killer. That's a good Whoa. record. We got it. Uh, calling all serial killers. <laughs> There's fertile ground over in Iceland. They're not going to ever see you coming, man. <laughs> we should go to Iceland, everyone. It's, so it's a perfect place to strike. Killing them. Murder. Like, yeah. murder. It's, it was murder. In there. <laughs> all right. One of the safest countries, like you said, very low crime and murder rates. Huh. They're too busy dodging lava flows and shit, evidently. <laughs> crime. Because I feel like the whole country is just like a tiny community. Mm. It's a you know what's the population of Iceland? It's really Iceland small, right? population. It's really I think I bet it's small. less than a million. Three hundred, yeah, way less. Three hundred seventy-two thousand. Wow. Ventura has that many people, right? It's the mm. size of the yeah half the size of the valley. Mm -hmm. Yeah, <laughs> that's crazy. Everybody knows everybody, probably. Mm -hmm. Very good. I cannot wait when the kids grow up we're gonna travel the world Ethan with or without them I don't care with or they can without come or they can stay mm -hmm. or you mean like when they're like off to college type of shit or like no. when they're in high school just or when it's school? like not like you need like I don't know whenever we feel like we can go for like two weeks I guess I don't know what's the appropriate age for that it is gonna be nice because this whole time that we, I mean, we've been working a lot. Fortnite. And, and, you know, these are the work years of being an adult. And also for me, nice have living time. here away from Israel, it's like every time I travel somewhere, it's to Israel to visit my family. Yeah. So I'm like so, what's the word? Amped. You're ready to do it. I'm so ready to travel. Yeah, it'll be nice. I have, and I, I have not traveled that much. Like I've been mm -hmm. only to Germany and Europe. You know, probably go there. Show up at work and work harder. <laughs> Gotta get out to Japan, you know? Japan, I'm dying. Oh, speaking of which, okay. <laughs> so, we got to plan a trip. We said, let's just go to Vegas. <clears throat> Ela is fairly, I mean, very pregnant. Yeah. I need the max win. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to have to get some of those hats for the table, Zach. Oh, my God. <laughs> We're, uh, obviously you're pregnant, so being in Vegas is a horrible place with the smoke. Yeah, I can't Essentially smoke everywhere. Also, I'm getting quite uncomfortable sitting lately. So, I don't know that I can enjoy it really. Yeah. A geologist with PhD here, I would not recommend this experiment, especially if you think you could pick the thermos back out. Lol. <laughs> Why not? Whatever, what do you know? <laughs> what do you know, geologist? Tell me. <laughs> Mind your own business. Well, so we don't need to, like, pick it back out and, you know, obviously touch it or, like, interact with it. We just need to see if the, the ice is still intact inside. So, like, what would it be? We would, di we would, like, dip it in lava for just, like, a moment or two and then lift it out and see if there's still a rattle? More than that. 
30 How long seconds. do you think? I don't know. I've, no way. 30 seconds is gone. Is melted into that shit, I'm pretty sure. I don't think well, I'm that isn't it like, It's like 5,000 degrees, isn't it? Something no, it's insane. Less. Especially it doesn't when look it's on, that how hot. hot is when it's flowing. When it's flowing. When it's on the top, it's It'll probably way less than five. Okay, two thousand. That's what the Ish. that's what the flame was. Yeah. Yeah. Is that? Mm. Flame? No, like four four hundred fifty was the flame. Mm. Oh. Well, it's different dipping it in it as well. Yeah, I would think. Right. What is that? Turkey. Turkey, I think. What's this? No. <laughs> For Percini. I don't know. <laughs> Still don't know. <laughs> okay, so the PhD here, Mr. PhD says, don't do it. Okay, whatever, dude. This person said, I watched a doco about a volcano in New Zealand which erupted while people were there on tour. It is the scariest shit I've ever yeah. seen. Do not go to an active volcano tour with peace and love. Well, tell that to our other viewer who literally <laughs> makes their living as a volcano tour right. guide. It's kind of kind of messed up to say. Right. I mean, the chances that it explodes while you're there, usually if a volcano is about to have an explosion, there are some warning signs, mm -hmm. such as like seismic activity, smoke, stuff like this. So it's not like you're going in there and totally uh, chancing it. Obviously, it can't happen, though. Um, you just got to live, man. <clears throat> just got to live, man. Just let me throw some Life is all about risks. Right. So yeah. anyway, I was saying, sh do you guys want to go? Ela has said that we can go without her. Mm -hmm. so boys just trip? To do it. Just no to, girls? Just to do it. Just the I boys. Didn't say that. No <laughs> girls allowed. <laughs> How did it become no girls? Only one girl uh, can't go. <laughs> no, he's right. No girls. <laughs> right, he's or right. we let the guys go, and then after Ela has the baby, we do a girl strip. Nope. <laughs> I think it's only fair. <laughs> I'm against the girls' trip. Bro. A bro. I'm not a fan of boys' trip either. Dude. I learned from That's Vanderpump Rules. bullshit. Rule. Yes. I never send the boys alone to Vegas. <laughs> Even though you guys are not that kind of boys, but yeah. that is some BS. Ethan Klein, the boys over there. Honestly, in Vanderpump Rules, though, it's such a funny meme because every time they went there and they insisted on going there all the time, mm -hmm. one of them would cheat. Yes. One of them would get blackout. Someone would get in fight. Like, they are... So, I don't know why they kept wanting to go yeah. back. You get tattoos. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. The worst tattoo. He got a history. tattoo for his girlfriend that was so hideous. She demanded he remove it when he showed it to her. Yeah. It was an A, and she called it the bacon A, because it looked like it, it was, was made out of bacon. It was so bad. Can you pull it up, Tom's... <laughs> yes. Tattoo. This yeah. is me in, uh... This is me in, uh, Hawaii, by the way. You want to keep the Stanley Cup? Is that what's happening? Why are you using? You're just like, no, I want the cup. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's mine. I claim it. My precious ice bearing cup. So I don't know. There's that, or we can wait till after the pregnancy, but like, I feel like we're never going to do anything. Yeah, we... that's the thing. I feel like if we wait, then um, it's going to be too much waiting. So. So let's fucking go tonight. Can I go tonight? Let's hop in the car. Yeah. She says, yeah. Let's go. Let's go right now. What are we doing here? We just leave the show, right? Who cares? <laughs> you guys want to go tonight? I'll Who go can right go now. tonight? Right Thanks for watching, everyone. <laughs> right here. Raise your hand if you can go tonight. No hand. Not one hand. Um, <laughs> AB. Thank you, AB. I, I guess I can. Dan. That's what I'm saying. You have to be spontaneous. Nobody? Well, if you guys want to go on a, 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 a company Wait, me, trip, it's right now or never. <laughs> let me let me think about it for two seconds. But no, we I can... know that I have rehearsal tomorrow, but I could, if we go to Vegas, I could probably tell them I can't go. So, hmm. Let me talk to them. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll bring in Ethan's note. Yeah, we can give you a, a note. Mm hmm. My girl's in Vegas. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, it's going to be posh. <laughs> it's going to be good. Posh, huh? Mark Swain. Oh, yeah, why not? Zach, are you going to fly with us? We can talk home. about it. I really hope you do. It's so fast, dude. Even if you hate flying, I swear to God, it's like up and down. We'll, uh, we'll talk about it. Okay. All righty, then. I sent that tattoo. I should probably do the ad. and then. Oh, here it is. Yep. Oh God, why is it so, that's the best picture there is? <laughs> yeah, I needed to zoom in a lot. 
Okay. So he got it's an a. the first letter of her name on his butt. <laughs> it's just so ugly. <laughs> and then the other Tom got Bubba on yeah, his Both butt. of them are divorced, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> both of them are separated. Yeah. Shocking. Yeah. That's real shocking. <laughs> um, let's do our ad and then we can get into actually a segment that I've been waiting to talk about. Mm -hmm. The surgery segment. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. You know? We did a, Why are you saying it like that? <laughs> we did a yeah. special preparation. We cook something up. Okay? Mm. So let's thank our sponsor. You know who they are? It's Hexclad. I love Hexclad. I love Hexclad. <laughs> I'm one of these people who's been searching high and low for the perfect pan. Basically, ever since we came back and had a kitchen, Mm -hmm. We're like, what is the best pan? You know, you go, you try stuff from Amazon. You go to right. Costco. We bought like a super expensive stainless steel one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is the pan that I was looking for the whole time. It doesn't scratch. It cooks beautifully, evenly. It doesn't stick. It is somehow achieved perfect panda. <laughs> Some people call it pandemonium. Mm. But in a good way. It's pure mm. chaos because people just cannot get over how good they are. Yeah, I love them. We have the, uh, I use them on everything. I use them on when I'm cooking like from pasta to a steak to a hole in the bread. Mm -hmm. Right. It's all happening on Hexclad, you know, and I love them. Um, <coughs> don't take it from me. Take it from... The greatest chef in the world, Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> Hexlab's industry-leading cookware doesn't Go just ahead, stop Gordon. with pans. Its six-piece pot set will perfectly round out your cooking collection. From mashing the most amazing potatoes to even mm. tempering chocolate, I promise you the combination of hexagonal peaks and valleys provides a, a superior heating conductivity. The way he I bounces on his heels is so... He's energetic. Impressive. He's excited to be there. He's just, excited yeah. to tell you about Hex Clad. all the time. He goes, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He is brimming with energy. Mm -hmm. yeah. Non-stick service and ultimate durability. There's no limit to what you can do when you have the very best tools. Get creative and dazzle your family and friends. It's time to get cooking. So, time to get cooking. Gordon Ramsay would not lie about this. Mm -hmm. Yep. His reputation is on the line. That's for sure. I mean, if he likes it, then who are you to say that it's not perfect? Right. Who are you? Who are you? Who are you even? Yeah, I recommend, uh, let's see. I don't, I keep always forgetting to bring my pans. It's so frustrating because I, I just, always use them. I use them, they're dirty, you know, like last time they were dirty and you know, they didn't look good because I just cooked with them. Um, trying to find. Let me just go to their website. I'm constantly asked what my culinary secret weapon is. I just want to show is. you how cool the pans look. The true, the only true hybrid, they say, cookware. It's got this really cool hexagonal shape, which apparently... For uh, those they, counting, that's two more sides than a rectangle. Dude, rectangles are crying in shame. <laughs> <It's>, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, they're not. No. It apparent the hexagonal shape, I guess, makes it stick less and evenly cook. I think. The not peaks a, and I'm valleys. Not a scientist. It's because of the peaks and valleys. Peaks and valleys. Hexagonal peaks and valleys. Like life. Mm-hmm. But um, the sets are really great. I recommend it big time. I love them. And and most of all, they they support our show. So if you're in the business and the look out for some beautiful cookware. Look no further. It's hex clad. Um, let's see here. I got a code for you guys. Find your forever cookware at hex clad and get 10% off at hexclad.com slash H3. That's it. One more time. Hexclad.com slash H3 for 10% off. Thank you, everybody, for, uh, for considering to support them. You got it. All right. Oh, there's donors? Well, let's thank them real fast then. Let me go over to the... We have a donations 
room on Discord so we don't miss room. any. <clears throat> it's my 27th birthday. It says Rose Hallow. My name is my name Rex or no oh they Nolan, mm. Ren and Everett. Mm. By the way, today the gang has all prepared one perfect name to pitch us and we are going to put them to the audience and whatever whichever one wins, we are going to name our child. 100% guaranteed. I don't care what it is. Rumple still skin, I don't care. <laughs> is that that's that's it cuz we can't decide okay. and I'm getting frustrated. Mm. So if it's Rumple still skin, if Rumpy. it's uh fart <laughs> just fart. <laughs> fart fart <laughs> <laughs> Are they going to be serious suggestions? Yeah, yeah. Oak suggestions. It's the audience. They've all come together with their most serious suggestion mm -hmm. that they're going to pitch to us. Exciting. Brittany says, I remember you saying that Teddy loves the name Lavender for a girl. How about mm -hmm. Leander for a boy? Leander. Leander. What's Leander. Leander? Have to let it linger. <laughs> Wait, what's uh -huh. Leander? It's like um, uh, Young Lean's last name is Leander. Oh, Leander. Maybe I'm saying it wrong. Leander? Mm. Leander. That's nice. That's an interesting name. I like it. Um, Montana Joe, Thir Ethan Thirstchat, rise up. You look hot, kink. And mm. Hila, incredible as always. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. It's a little long on the top. It's a bit broccoli -ish. It's broccoli-esque. Not full broccoli. Shanna <laughs> says, please, if anyone wants to, send your prayers for my family. I lost my mom last night due to heart failure and car crash. All your prayers are mm. greatly appreciated mm. at the moment. I know she's in a better place. Oh my god. Uh, sorry about that. Sorry for your loss. It's horrible. Yeah. Sorry to hear that. Mm. Love you. Um, Love ya! Alright. Where do we go from there? Mm. This is not a dono, but someone said this earlier. I forgot to mention. They said the person that was sitting at the counter when you're doing the shit test probably knew you were a fan, and that's why they said that the toilet wasn't working because they knew you would clog it. <laughs> oh. Yep. Well, hold on, uh, genius. I'm shitting in the fucking receptacle. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> and then I dump it in afterwards. So there's no, there's no like towel <laughs> uh, engineering. Could, there could be. <laughs> Love, there's a Fika Fest happening in Chicago next month. Huh? What? That's just weird. Look yeah. into that. V says, lie to me like you used to. I don't know what that means. I would never lie to you. I've never lied. Uh, Ethan Klein, a mix of Ethan, his name, and Duckies. Also pulled to see the superior race watching H3. What the fuck? What? Pull to see the superior race watching H3? You want me to like pull people's races? Like a census? Hmm. Uh, all right, there's actually too many. I just, I, I feel bad. There's too many. What's going on here? I'll do more after at the end. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you everybody though for your support. Thank you, thank you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you to the members. <clears throat> All right, so up next, let's see. We got options. We can do the baby naming game, or we can do the uh, plastic surgery segment, which we've done a little sp something spicy and nice with. Okay. You have a preference? Selfishly, I want to do the baby name, but whatever. We'll get to both. <laughs> I'm curious what the people think, actually. Yeah. If they're... um. If they're invested in the baby name situation, or maybe they want a spicy thing. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm curious what the people want. Uh, that's me, you doing a poll? Is that, <laughs> sure. That was, I don't know if that was translated in what I was saying. I was picking up on that. Mm -hmm. Let me see if I got my test results. Oh, I got it! Mm. <laughs> Alright. I'm about to find out if I need to do a colonoscopy or not. Oh, God. Dr. Doolittle, Jake Doolittle, you watching? Somebody clip this and send this to Jake. This was my ass. Okay. Looks like I have one. 
It's a parasite enteric pathogen panel. I am negative for a parasite. Thank God for that. Parasite, man. Good. It was they tested me for Jardia, mm. Cryptosporidium, an Entamoba, and and Tam and Tamoba. All right, that's it. You, that's it, Zach. All right, we got one. Okay. Good. All right. Someone send that to uh, Jake Doolittle, please. Thank you. No, <laughs> Ethan, that's not how that works. Well, I need your con I need your consent before I move forward with any treatment. Oops. Me and me and my doctor for forgot to consult with you. <laughs> Um, well, fuck. Hey, Ethan, you love you guys. Brittany says, my name is ideas are Fenner, Archer, Apollo, Kane, and Dakota. Mm. Those are nice. I appreciate the suggestions. They're out of the box, you know? Yeah. Oh, people want the baby name. Okay, let's do the baby name. We'll do the, the plastic surgery thing afterwards. It's all going to be fun. Okay. We'll, we'll, we'll slam right through the baby name thing. All right. Go. <laughs> Here's the deal. Welcome, everybody, to the baby game. Me and Ela are incapable of deciding on a name, and so we put this together for you, the people, and here, my trusted uh, crew. Each one has picked their very favorite one name for our beautiful, soon-to-be-born boy. Yes. I don't know if he's beautiful. I haven't seen him yet. He'll be beautiful no matter Statistically what. Statistically speaking, though, we have a 100% beautiful baby uh, rate. Right. <laughs> So, he might come out and be like, eesh. <laughs> Broke the streak on that one, eh? Probably, uh, not. Probably, not. Probably not. Probably not. Thank you. So who wants to go first? Uh, yeah, and so we're going to put it to the audience. The one that wins, we are going to name our child 100%. No cap, as the kids at home say, might say to you. Okay. The kids around the world are saying to each other. Yeah. No cap. No cap on a stack. I don't think I believe you. <laughs> well, let's do the game. You'll find out. <laughs> also, um, I, I'm just going to say up front, uh, I don't have one. What? what? Couldn't come up with one. I thought about it a lot. You have to. That's not helping me at all. Dan, you're not I, know. About I, I don't know what to say. I, I, I tried to come up with a name. I mean, you guys should sympathize. You've been trying to come up with a name, and you couldn't. All right, let's start with you, Lena. <laughs> <laughs> Gen, okay. It wasn't for a lack of trying. <laughs> But it was supposed to be a serious suggestion. I made it hard. Yeah. I got lots of joke suggestions, but like, I don't know what. There's not do. one that you like, like, kind of at least, something you can put forward? Uh, not really. Not even a single one. I mean, we, there's so many that we've talked about, too. It's just like, I don't know. Maybe something will come to you. <laughs> we'll see. All right. Uh, whoever's got one. Yeah, just, I can start. I have go one. ahead, Nina. So we just say what it, ours is. You guys have a group, you've, as a group, come together. You and AB. Oh, we have separate names. No, we have separate names. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. yeah, go ahead, say what okay, it yeah. is. Anyways, mine is Ezra. Mm. Ezra. That's nice. Mm -hmm. What is the... What is I will the... say, it's kind of cool here in Israel, not so much. Is that an Israeli mm -hmm. name? Mm-hmm. It's like an old guy. Ezra, name. Uh, meaning. I means helper, helper. Yeah, it's from, it's from the word help, Lazo. Okay. I like it though. I mean, that's one that we hadn't considered, which is I appreciate when it's something. It's been suggested to me oh, by Vio. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, I think it's sweet. I like it. Thank you, Lena. Ezra. Mm -hmm. Star Wars character. Ezra. The little ducklings. <laughs> I'm about to have a new duck to the family. <laughs> All right, AB. Then, Dan, if you just pull them up, the little tabs, it'll reveal it. Oh, oh wow. look at that. What? Oh, that was cool. That's awesome. That was oh. really cool. Oh. oh, you know the names already. Or are you typing it? No, no I, we I, know them already. Yeah, I got the graphic. Cam is the only one that knows everything. <laughs> I, I said uh, Levi. Okay. I like Levi. Oh, you, was... you're a dork, though, for that. <laughs> Big dork. Well, it's no, a, this is a my... major dork alert. It's an attack on Titan. Well, weapon. a few things. The boys <laughs> like lavender. It sort uh -huh. of sounds like that. Also, it's a Hebrew name. Mm -hmm. But 99%. Mm -hmm. 
fucking Captain Levi, baby. Honestly, it was on our list. Levi's a really good name. Yeah. Hell yeah. I really like that. It's a cool name, Levi. Yeah, I like it. But you gotta say it like the way they do in the Japanese version. Levi. Like Levi. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder you... if in Hebrew that would become Levi. I don't know. Maybe somebody in the chat would know. Anime watchers. You guys notice how like... What they say on screen... Wait, what am I saying? They're... What I'm about to say doesn't make any sense. So I stop myself. Okay. I'm trying to reformulate my thought. Okay. Mm -hmm. Right? Just saying. Calculating. Calculating. Like, when they reading the... F when it, the Japanese is written out, like, phonetically in English... Or, like, names specifically. that That's what where you see it a lot. Like, the what they write in the English letters has, like, no bearing at all on how they actually say it. It confuses the hell out of me when I'm trying to figure out how to say it in names. Like, like, uh... Uh, what's his Sus Susuke? What's that name? Sasuke. <laughs> Sasuke. Sasuke. And they spell it like S A S U K E. No? Suzuki. Mm -hmm. You're saying like in the uh, closed <laughs> captions, the yeah. Well, however they spell it phonetically, you know, in English, mm -hmm. right? Or not? Phon I guess it's not phonetically. I don't know who decides how you spell that shit. I'd like a re. I'd like a redo on that. Who decides how we spell it in English? Is there a panel? <laughs> That's a good, I, I think, just convention. Mm. All right, love, let's do it in order. You go ahead. Me? <clears throat> All right, mm -hmm. so I harness the power of AI, aka uh. ChatGPT, because I was, much like Dan, a very <sighs> hard hard time to personally pick one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I asked ChatGPT, and I didn't just ask after a good name, I asked a name that would fit Bruce and Theodore. And okay. the genuine, genuine response was Oliver. Mm. That's crazy. <laughs> and I, kn I know, obviously, we know someone named Oliver that sucks. But I think, since you guys actually like that word, you shouldn't let that stop you guys. Mm -hmm. And we should take over Oliver, like the word Oliver. Take and make, it back. Make it the baby's it name. Ours. And fuck Oliver Tree, because he don't deserve that name. Mm -hmm. and then I, I don't even know if that's his real name, frankly. Probably, it's just a stage name, probably, anyways. Genuinely, I don't <laughs> know. And then I asked for like probably a, John, Sean or something. Yeah, I have something been dumb. thinking about it that maybe that's why we're having such a hard time yeah. because it was gonna be Oliver probably most likely, mm -hmm. and then we all started talking about like, but Oliver Tree and blah, blah, blah. well, Scotty was the original one, and we were like, I didn't think about it for a long time. It's like Scotty. Um, I think it was Oliver before Scotty even. Oh yeah, I think so yeah, too. From was... what I've heard, I do love that name, and I Me think too. it's perfect and cute and it fits. And I also asked for like some this. This I asked for afterwards, just a mm. list of things. Like, one thing that um, stuck out International to me. International appeal. I, that actually stuck out to me because <laughs> I know a lot of Olivers all over Europe uh, in yeah. very many languages I that see. it works. So, and can, even in Hebrew, it works. See? Timeless. Yeah. What the fuck? Great. Harmonizes Timeless. with sibling name. It complements well the classic names like mm -hmm. Bruce and Theodore. Like what, creating wait. a cohesive set of names. What do they mean by that? Theodore. Theodore. Bruce, Bruce. Oliver. I'm sorry, what? I agree with that. I agree. It's a good vibe. Classical. Yeah. yeah. Just seems like they're blowing a bunch of smoke up our ass. <laughs> yeah, no. GPT. No, 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 no. This is... This is it. Mm. Okay. Okay. That's a good one. I mean, that's that's a golden one. Yeah. Yeah. I think you guys should stick to it. Absolutely love Oliver. Me too. I'm gonna wrap this up. I'm done, guys. All right. <clears throat> All right. Up next, Samantha. Samantha. So I picked a first and a middle name. I thought we were supposed to do both. That's fine. Okay. okay. I picked Art Lorenzo Klein. Art. Oh. So not Arthur. It's Art. No, just Art. Art Lorenzo. Here, Art Lorenzo. Artie. Okay, I like it. Ooh. Castle. Artie's a cute name for to call your kid. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's like a nickname. Artie. Was... Artie. Um. I like Artie as a nickname. Art's nice. I like it. Mm -hmm. I like the Lorenzo. Lorenzo. That's kind of <laughs> unexpected. Well, you place. guys seem to. Uh, when we talked about it last time, you liked a lot of like Italian-inspired names. Yeah. True. So I thought it was kind of a vibe. Mm-hmm. Those Italians they will be 7.5 percent Italian, so <laughs> it's not stolen valor. I like it. Thank you, Sam. Of course. Ian. Uh, okay, I like names that sound up with the alliteration, like ba ba. Mm-hmm. You know, ba ba. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I'm pitching Casey Klein. Casey? Casey. Casey Klein. Mm. Casey wow. Klein. I do like the alliteration. Casey Klein, yeah. nice. Sometimes you need you, that. You remember it. <laughs> you know? People change their names for the alliteration. It's you know, they come to Hollywood and they say, I need I need it to be that pow pow. Right. Mm -hmm. I don't right. know what you guys are talking about. It's when the, the beginning of both the words have the same sound. Mm. Mm -hmm. Like Calvin Klein. Yeah. I like mm -hmm. Casey. Casey's nice. Casey. Yeah. Yeah. Your idol. The yeah. only person you love more than me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Casey, okay. Thank you, Ian. Yeah. I like it. Very welcome. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Olivia. Okay, so the name that I am suggesting is Luca. Mm. Mm. Luca Brazzi. Luca Klein. Luca. Luca. Mm. Well, Luke. Thank you, Luke. Like oh, L U. <laughs> would it be L U C A? L U C A, yeah. <laughs> Luca. That's Luke. cute. All right, well, I don't like Ryan saying it. It makes me feel icky about it. <laughs> it's of Italian origin, means bringer of light. Oh, oh, I like that. Oh, I like Luke light. Skywalker. Beautiful. Love that. Thank you. Oh, Appreciate absolutely. that. Cam? Hi. <coughs> uh, so you guys kind of like unique names. You were throwing out Ducky and Buster at first and all that. <laughs> so I kind of went with one that I haven't seen too often, and I picked uh, Salem Xavier Klein. Salem. Salem. Named after my favorite small city in Mass. <laughs> Salem. And Xavier. Xavier. Named after my favorite uh, mass murdering event. <laughs> it's a beautiful small city, though. <laughs> beautiful town. Salem. Beautiful town. Xavier. Klein. I like the Carble. Xavier. Per we could call Salem? him Professor X. Is Salem like <coughs> Salam? Or is that a different. I word? say Salem? No, uh, no, it's it's Salem. Yeah. It's a different word. Yeah. A different word. Yeah. yeah. Salam looks sim similar. Two ways. But Salam um, Xavier Klein is <laughs> kind of dope X, too. X, X. <laughs> yeah. What does Salam mean? Salam means greeting. It's like Shalom. Oh, okay. Yeah, hello. Oh, it does? Yeah. Yeah. Salam Aleikum. Oh. What does Malaikum mean? Oh, it's just it's a it means like my baby. <laughs> you say no, it's it just means a like, uh, <laughs> It means like right back at you. Mm. Right back no, at no, you. No, I mean, oh. it means like, yeah, hello, peace be upon you, then like right back at you. More peace yeah. upon you, my yeah. friend. Even Salamu, more peace. Assalamu alaikum wa salam. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Yeah, I'm teaching. Oh, whoa, whoa. Flexing, whoa. brother. I'm going okay. to convert, convert him by the end of the year. Okay. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Mashallah. He knew that already. Cam, you're on a watch list now. <laughs> Is that no good? Should I button that? Is it funny? <laughs> I thought it was funny. It's fine. <laughs> All right. I w in my head, I was like, I think it's funny, but I might have to bail. <laughs> Thank you. <clears throat> uh, Zachariah. Mm. So you guys, you like those kind of <clears throat> classical type names. Mm -hmm. um, I thought the name Sylvester would... Uh, oh, Sylvester. You, yeah, you can call him, you know, Sly or Sil or... Um, mm. I don't Vester, know. Ter, Sylvester. Ter. Best. Sylvester. Steffi. Yeah. I think it would be very Olivia. fitting. And it's a... Actually, I like it. It's cool. Yeah. So, Suffering Suffetat. Suffering, yeah. So, <laughs> what? It almost seems related to Buster. Like. Sylvester. Buster Sylvester Klein. <laughs> I don't know. I think it'd be fitting, and it's. I like it. Thank yeah. you, Zach. Yeah, okay. I love the. Um, Those are good suggestions. I think you guys all really brought yeah. great, great names here. Unexpected, unique, oh, wonderful names. And Dan is a. And comment. Dan didn't do his homework. Dan, I need your name. I don't have one. How about just Dan? I even asked Allie for help. Yeah, Dan, I think, would be the submission. You know... <laughs> not to sound too full of myself. You think... Good name, good Daniel Jewish name. Dan? Daniel, Daniel it served Klein. served you well? It served me great. How does it serve Keemstar? I, I, and I know a lot of other Daniels. Oh, shit, that's true. Keemstar. I was about to say, <laughs> like, Daniel, Daniels are genu generally good guys, but... That is, I well, guess there's, there's an exception to every rule, yeah. Exactly. All right, so you don't want to put anything in there, Dan? You want to put Dan? I mean, no. you want to put Keemstar? <laughs> Keemstar. Clash. Wait, wait, wait. I got, I got, I got, I got. <laughs> Go ahead. What you got, Zach? Zach. No, not put Mega Man. Yeah, why not Mega Man? Oh, Mega Man Klein? That's kind of fire. Yeah, why not? Not put Mega Man. <laughs> I like Mega Man. Put Mega Man. You want that? No, this is these are serious names. That was the thing. Is it, like, I can I can come up with joke name suggestions, but 
I, I just couldn't nail one that that felt right. All right, so Dan is okay. uh, he's ab, uh, abstaining from voting. Yep. IDK coin. Leave me out of this. So right now, uh, we, now the idea is that the people get to vote, and the name is the name. That's it. We're done. It's over. Really? Should we should we add into the mix the one that we kind of added lately, or not? Maybe we should do a round with these names and then have whatever wins that compete against the name you're talking about. I think I mentioned that, but well, yeah. 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 Um, let's go ahead. What was that, AB? Sorry, nothing. <laughs> what? What? What happened? Oh, nothing. I was going to say uh, we could potentially have all these compete, and then that name goes against the name you guys were referring to. But it looks like mm. you guys moved on. So I, I said, I'm out. I see, yeah, I I'm out. Yeah. So th can we put all these up on a poll? I have to I'm do so an off YouTube one for that many. What the people would vote for? People like Oliver. Yeah. I know that. I do know that. And I people know that we know they know that we like Oliver. Right. <clears throat> So, I might actually pick that. I think that's the most likely, although I'll say, I can't see anything else winning, frankly, than Oliver. Le Levi's nice, Ezra's nice, Art, Casey, they're all nice. They're all nice. Luca's really cute. Too. I actually like Luca a lot. Is, does anybody hope Sylvester that I don't pick their name cute. because they want it for their baby? I already have my baby names picked out, so... Can you tell me what? I'll, I'll tell you later. <laughs> I actually wanted to name my son Bruce if I ever had a kid named Bruce. Really? Yeah, you guys, you guys got Are it. Are you serious? Show. Yeah. That's awesome. What? I love that. Yeah. Because that name is like... I, I never, got so much pushback. Yeah. I never met anybody else that was down with the name, honestly, except Ethan. People were even sending me memes of tweets with like hundreds of thousands of likes. Yeah. Like, imagine Whoa. having a boy and naming him Bruce. Yeah. I, I like, love it. Dude. It's great. You know he, what? It fits him so perfectly <laughs> now. It's like, I love it. I love the name with him. Mm -hmm. It's perfect. And yeah. a baby's not going to be a baby forever, too. You know, it's a long-term investment there. Exactly. It's a, <laughs> exactly. It's like pit, Apple stock at, you know, 30 years ago. For yeah. now, for now he's Brucey, and it's super cute. Aww. Yeah, it's so cute. I, I named, my, my name's after somebody I grew up with. <clears> so <throat> that was my pick for it. I've I mean, never known an older person named Cameron. Like, they're mm -hmm. all, like, your age or younger. Isn't that weird? weird? Well, I never met another Cameron at all. Me too. I've known a few Camerons growing up. Really? I think it was just a popular name when we were, hmm. uh, we are, we are lads than we mm. are now. Somebody said Baxter. Mm. It's a name, a uh, mix of Buster and Rex. Rexter. <laughs> Art Vandelay. <laughs> Art Vandelay. Soda clan. <laughs> <laughs> I don't soda. hate we, soda. We thought soda. about that, honestly. Soda? <laughs> yep. <laughs> but I feel like it's more for a girl for some reason. Yeah. So it's up. Let's go, guys. The we results of this are binding. Whatever it is, Whoa. we're putting it to the tech. We're putting it to rest. And it's kind of as I predicted that it would be yeah. Oliver. <clears throat> Everybody is saying Oliver Klein. Me and Lena have always had a name picked out for a girl. If we had a girl, but we never said it because we're afraid her sisters will take it. Oh. Or my cousins can. But I was thinking maybe I should. But no, if you say it, then they can't take right, it. Right. Maybe if I say oh. it here on air. That's yes. like a tap tap seat back. It's yours. Okay. Say it. Can you switch to me, Ian? I need to be able to show this <laughs> in, in, in case it ever comes up. We want to name our daughter Evelyn and then Evie for short. Oh. Mm. Evelyn? Mm -hmm. That's yeah. really cute. Yeah. There was. Um, Make sure your sisters see this. This tap tap seatback. We seat have the proof now, so. Oh, Evelyn. Doesn't mean they have to like respect it. I don't. Oh, they're going to respect That'd it. That'd be crazy <laughs> if they named it. <laughs> their, their I'm, kid I'm honestly, her sisters are respectful. I'm not worried about her sisters. I'm more worried about my cousins. Oh, yeah. The cousins, yeah. They, they can do anything. Yeah. There was the musician called Eve, I think. When mm -hmm. I was growing up, I used to listen to her songs and she would go like E, V, E. Yeah. And I thought it was so cool. <laughs> it's for me, my grandma is Gwendolyn <laughs> and I grew up at her house and her favorite movie was The Mummy. The main character is Evelyn. In that, mm. in oh, that that's movie. nice. Yeah, Gwendolyn? That's mm -hmm. a nice name too. Yeah. 
I like Evie being short for it. Mm -hmm. for, yeah. Uh, that's a cute name. <laughs> well, it looks like the people have spoken. We have 7,000 votes in, but there's a clear statistical winner here. It's Oliver Klein with nearly 40% of the vote. Mm -hmm. Now, let me say this. Y'all really thought I was going to let you guys decide the name of my <laughs> child? <laughs> Give me a break. We decided on a name. Oh. Whoa. Did we? I think so. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> I don't know if we did, did. I think we did. I don't know if we did, 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 did. I think it's that one. Oh my God. <laughs> but we have been saying all of last week that like maybe it's Oliver. Maybe it's just got to be Oliver. So no, I'm, I'm, but, I'm in on this one. Okay, let's, I've let's, let's say it. Oh, wow. So here is the real name, we do think. You, we think. Interrupt. Do you want to wait this Dan? Week. Dan went to the restroom. Just he doesn't care about what does, my uh, baby's he, called. Yeah. <laughs> he doesn't care about this show. He doesn't clearly. even make Just don't be nice. Just don't be nice. He could have held it if he cared about me at all. Yeah. <laughs> you know? Okay, here's the name. With peace and love. Mm. I hope you like it. If you don't, I'm still going. The name is... After much deliberation and thought, lists on lists, <laughs> consulting with family, friends. No, we didn't. Oh, and the new name, we didn't. Well, in general. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We have come together. Oh, shit, Anson's is here. No way. <laughs> That's the perfect time. Oh, it's heavy, too. Shit. This baby name is we brought to you, bro. throw out this. So, wait, I'm going to smash the yeah. Subway cookie with the Anson's. <laughs> no. <laughs> so here, the name is Sunny. <gasps> oh my! Really? <laughs> and oh, spelled like S-U-N-N-Y, like Sunny. I, uh, you know, I actually recommend. I love that name, and I yes. recommended it, and I tried to change it, but Cam made the graphic already. <laughs> you you were gonna say yeah. that? Yeah. Yeah. What? Can I, I, can I say can something? I oh my God! I'm so glad you didn't, because I didn't want. <laughs> you didn't want to pick from the. Crew? I want. Yeah, I didn't want to. So I went out to go get the uh, the Ann Sons. So you guys had a name and you lied <laughs> and made all of us stress about coming up with these names. Yeah. He lied. No intention of using. <laughs> no intention. I was kind of ready to use the the winner. I w my the whole thing was I thought I explained my my. You did, but I was kind of like because the eel was like we should put the name we're thinking of, us, and I was like, no, 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 that's not. I was like, no, 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 that's not it. <laughs> um. <laughs> I said, do you all really think I would let you guys name my child, my son? Right. So anyway, I, I don't believable. know. believable. Yeah, it is believable. believable. Well, they, they all believed it. <laughs> but we said Sonny. I don't know if you heard. I heard the Sonny part, yeah. Yeah. Sonny. Sonny on a rainy afternoon. Sonny. Hey, Gabe. Hey, what's going on? We just we just yeah. announced we just announced our um Danny, our Danny. baby name. Sunny. <laughs> yep, Sunny. Yep. Ooh. Woo. Fuck yeah. Nice shirt. How you doing? Hey. I'm good. I'm repping 83. I'm repping Teddy Fresh. Fuck. It's King's Day, so I'm having a fucking pizza. Let me see what you're working on. Gabe is eating pizza, ladies and gentlemen. Pizza, oh, that's a fat, that's a fat crust. Who made that? Fat pizza. Fuck pizza. Who made that? <laughs> Don't you think the crust is obscenely big on that? Pizza Hut. Dude, pizza kind of fucked you on that pie, dude. Don't you think? Probably. Yeah. Where's my fucking drink? Oh, then they forgot your drink, too. Where's my fucking drink? But let me see the pizza again. Oh, you're getting fed. Nice. That's respect. Oh, yeah. Gabe looks thin. Yeah. Let me see the pizza. You guys see what I'm saying? Look how fucking big the crust is. It's like half the damn pizza. He's already at the crust. <laughs> is, it, <laughs> is it stuffed? Is the crust stuffed, Gabe? Stuffed with bread. <laughs> <laughs> stuffed with bullshit. Uh. <laughs> All right. Well, how's it taste at least? Is it good at least? It's good. Nice. That's Working a hat. On this one. I mean, this my my second one. Oh, the kid! Now that's a pie. Yeah. Look at that! Mm. Now that's a pie right there, my friends. 
Gabe is, he's got two different pies, potentially from two different locations. They look so different. Mm -hmm. Now, which slice did you like better? The the bigger, the breadier one or the thinner one? I go with the um, bigger one because mm. it's just me there. Oh, you like mm -hmm. that one better? Yeah. And what is it you like about that one? <clears throat> the dough? You like the dough? I like the dough. I like mm -hmm. the. It looks doughy. You thirst? Go ahead and have a. Yeah, go ahead, drink. I love pizza and I love people. Thank you. I'll wait. Did you know pizza is actually very nutritious? Pizza is actually <laughs> very nutritious. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm happy for you. Seems like you've got a great weekend ahead. Starting with pizza, yeah. it's hard to go, you know, have a bad weekend after that. Yep. We're going to Norbu for the weekend, having the best sushi nice. in Norbu. Nice. I've never been there, actually. I mean, I'm not a big sushi consumer, but I've never been to Nobu. But I hear everybody, they love Nobu. Mm hmm the best atmosphere out there. Really? Gabe, I yeah. recall you saying you don't like sushi. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So 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 what's the real story here, Gabe? Are we going to Nobu? Yep. <laughs> Wait, now I don't believe you, Gabe. What are you actually doing? <laughs> See, you, you can't get anything by us. We know everything. <laughs> we know Uncle Gabe. I don't really have sushi, but I can have something else, like salmon or something. Okay. Okay, that's true. Do they offer yeah. cooked salmon at, at Nobu? Let's yeah, open the menu. Do that. <laughs> I'm going to get to the bottom of this, Gabe. <laughs> I, I think I've looked at the Nobu menu because we've thought about going there, and I specifically remember it's only like raw fish, which is why <laughs> I never ate there. Oh, hell yeah. That's my boy. That's a double bite. It has other stuff. They do? Mm -hmm. Okay. It, it checks out. There it is. What a good time back there. All right, Gabe. Well, it's nice to see you. Nice to hear days. from you. <laughs> Woo! Woo! Fuck, baby. Cameo. Fuck. You're on Cameo. That's where it all goes down for Uncle Gabe. He's going to woo, wish you a fuck, baby. I woo! Wish you a fuck, motherfucker. Wish you a fuck, bitch. Ow. I love you, Ethan. <laughs> oh, thanks, buddy. I love you, too. <laughs> good one. <laughs> that was good. All right, have a great weekend, Gabe. We love you. Keep crushing it on Cameo, bro brother. Have a great weekend. All right. <laughs> Bitch. How about that one? Bitch. <laughs> All right. Bitch. <laughs> that's uh that's uh, Uncle Gabe. The, art, the artist formerly known as White Claw, Gabe. Mm -hmm. So are we all loving Sunny? Yeah. I yes. love it. I do have a okay. question. Yeah. Is it to, like, further uh, Ethan's Godfather narrative that he's naming his son Sonny? Because the Godfather's son's name was Sonny. Are you serious? His oldest. I didn't son. know that. Said, well, it's the son that died, so I'm not, you know. But no, I just didn't know that. I mean, that's kind of cool. I, frankly, it's not like an homage, but I do remember watching that movie and thinking Sonny was a cool name. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Although that his name was short for some Italian. Santino. Santino. Santino cool. Corleone. He was cool. They assassinated him, though. They took him out. They Crazy. massacred my boy. Yeah. They massacred my boy. <laughs> they my Sonny. What did they do to my boy? And that's how you got Al Pacino. Yeah. Because his big brother was slain. Cold blood. Tiffany says, that's my future baby named Thievery. She's spelling it Sunny, like S-O-N-N-Y. See, mm -hmm. that one, I respect. To me, it's really important that it's the S-U-N-N-Y. Yeah, because Sunny's like, hey, Sunny boy. Yeah. Come on down here now, Sunny boy. And I'm I'm more thinking about, like, a sunny day. Yeah. Sunny. Now, does Sunny work with Scotty because it's S-S? Sunny, Scotty, Quine. It's vibes. 
It's vibes. Is it vibes? Yeah. I like it. Yeah. It's the alliteration that we've been looking for. It's SS deer. SS, like not like Nazi stuff. <laughs> You're saying it's double S tier. Not it's like double SS, S. like secret police. It could be, there was like Nazi stuff, right? That was SS. Yeah. It was the, uh, yeah. it was their, their uh, secret police, right? They were real bad dudes. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, it's sunny. So there it is, everybody. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks for playing. Ooh. Although I have to say, lovely, lovely suggestions. I everybody. do love the suggestions. They were very nice. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Sunny. It's a great right. name. Now you All guys, right. you have a Sunny and a Fredo in the family. Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> we're just missing a Michael, right? Michael and Connie. <laughs> you have a son named Michael. Right? right. Well, according to so Oliver percent. Tree, who's a liar and a thief and a fraud. <laughs> Don. Um, all right, well, thank you. Let's move on now to the plastic surgeon sketch that yes. I've been wanting to talk about this for so long. It's truly, <sighs> I don't even know how to say it. It's, it's astounding. It, it, it's, it's shocking. I mean, the first time I saw this video, I was stunned into silence for a few minutes. Okay, hold on, hold on before we move on. People think the SS is a problem. Why? Um, they didn't say why. They're just they're probably just kidding, no? It's a problem. No, they're not kidding. Why not? Well, fuck them. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Well, I'm committed. This is it. This is like when I got latched on to Bruce. Yeah. And I was like, no, come on. It's Bruce. And everyone's like, are you sure? Are you sure? Yes. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of good people with initials SS. Sylvester Stallone. Oh. Okay. But True. it's his middle name. It's the it's not Nobody even cares part of his about middle names. Name. His, name would be, his name would be SK. Mm -hmm. Which is my brother's initials, actually. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay, so we can move on. All right. So here is the video that shocked me into silence. <laughs> um, I don't know if you've seen this. I think I may have shown you it to you. <laughs> um, and it. it it's going viral for obvious reasons. Yeah. Well, not that viral. This only has 60,000 likes. Oh. Okay, hold on. Wait, why is it showing that? Okay, yeah. Before, look at this. This is him. He came to yeah. Dr. Kim for rejuvenation, and they turned this man <laughs> into... <laughs> I mean, what do you even say? I mean, I I'm just, don't know. I'm never, Faceless. I've never seen anything like it. They pulled his skin so hard, you can see like the creases in it. Oh, I'm being told oh. that's his actual, that's his actual face. What happened? They literally, you can see the scar lines around his whole face. Like they cut his whole fucking face off and pulled that shit tight like a drum. Oh. Yeah, I was trying to figure out what they did. I was watching some other doctor talk about it, and during a facelift, you remove skin by the ears and you pull back the face. With him, it looks like he did the whole the whole thing. I've oh. never seen yeah. like the scars on the forehead like that. Yeah. I think he looks oh. good. <laughs> <laughs> no, he, he looks way younger. He does. I mean, he looks young. He doesn't look human though. They changed his species. Let's see the before again. <laughs> Very pretty. He's a changeling. Here he is. Dark young and beautiful. Check it out. He's a nice dad. He's That's a good. That's like so much was pulled. <laughs> Bro. That's crazy. What the fuck? That mouth. Yeah. Where's he? Got, where's his mouth? And again, I listen. All love and respect to these people. He doesn't have much lips in the before. I don't True. Think you can blame that on yeah. the plastic surgery. I think he looks great. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is usually I. People say, what about when it heals? This was like, I think... It said seven days after? Yeah, like Whoa. a few weeks after already. I am curious, however... It how settled it's in. Yeah. I'm curious how it looks like now that everything healed fully. Well, there's a reason he don't show those. Right. Dr. Kim keeps them off his page oh, after yeah. two weeks. It's hard. You can't find anything for anyone. Homie Super went from weird. 51 to Creature, man. <laughs> and we love him. You know, it's not... Your, Dr. Kim just has an interesting style. Yeah. <laughs> He turned him into like a Bratz doll or whatever you call it. Like, I don't know what. What the <laughs> fuck, man? Bratz. 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 Bratz doll. <laughs> I still don't even really know what that means. I just, just remember Trisha saying it all the time. 
Bratz dolls. You don't remember Bratz? Those dolls. They were the best dolls. They're called Bratz, like uh-huh. Bratz? Yeah, B-R-A-T-Z. Bratz. With a Z, because they're kind of edgy. Oh, kinda, I didn't know that. Yeah. I didn't know what I was like even saying. kind of like the cooler Barbie. Uh-huh. Yeah, they're like the it girls of the dolls. <laughs> okay. It I was past okay. my time as a kid, <laughs> but uh, everybody yeah. knows about it. I didn't play with dolls. I didn't either, but... It was Surprised past our you time. Don't you know about it. I was Let's doing masculine press. shit, like riding bicycles and playing with action figures. Fucking sick. <laughs> Me too. Stretch cool Armstrong. Shit. Remember that? Yeah, I that. didn't have that. Either. He was so stretchy, dude. <laughs> I had this random memory, like you, you all remember Stretch Armstrong? Of course. It was this. It was. I've here, seen I'll, it I'll pull up only a in of my this. adulthood. But I know what you're it's, talking about. It was so cool. <laughs> like, I don't think we'd ever seen anything like it. It was this really strong, but also very pliable rubber. Yeah. That you could stretch and stretch and stretch and it wouldn't break. It was so fun, so cool. Oh, yeah, there it is. Yeah. And um, I was over at my friend's house, like my best friend at the time. We used to hang out all the time. I don't know what happened, but we were in the backyard. We were young, by the way, so I don't know. I don't remember how old, but we're dead. Kids. And there's like a hole in his backyard. And then we just put it in the hole and start peeing on it. <laughs> and then his mom came outside and was like, what the fuck are you doing? And oh she, my God. she never, I think she never, she blamed that on me. And I don't even, I don't mm. think that that was even my idea. But she, I, I would never, she never looked at me the same after that. Yeah. <laughs> that's <laughs> Cause crazy. that's weird as fuck. It, that well, yeah. weird. <laughs> How yeah. old were you, you think, when you did this? Uh, it's so hard to place it. Maybe like elementary school, under ten, a lot yeah. under ten, okay. eight, yeah. seven. Little kids do weird shit. Yeah, kids do yeah. weird. I'm telling <laughs> yeah. you, I'm just warning you now, Ela. Oh as God. our boys t- come closer to like, yeah, that age, ex- be prepared for weird, weird stuff. They're yeah. already like, <laughs> they like want to be naked and run around and dance. Uh-huh. And then they do this dance where they're like, <laughs> I'm gonna show you. They're just like this while they're naked. <laughs> Even Bruce does it. <laughs> oh, it's so funny. And I just, I don't, I already don't know what to do. Dude, they're oh, so funny. Yeah. They're so happy when they get their clothes off and they just start <laughs> running around like maniacs going, naked baby. <laughs> Bruce, he says, naked baby. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> um. Anyway, <laughs> let's look at more. There's a whole bunch here. <laughs> this is the. This video has a compilation. It's this doctor talking about it, which I don't really care about. I'm just gonna not worry about him. Uh, so this is our boy. Golly, fucking gee whiz on that one. Seven days after it says. Yeah. Now he look at her. She's. Pretty young lady. Mm-hmm. Looks good. Looks fine. Now, with a little magic. <laughs> Jesus. She looks like a fucking Skyrim character creation gone wrong. <laughs> she, does. she looks like, even old days, she looks like an Oblivion character. Right. I mean, she What's got pixels. The, what happened to the earlobes? Bro, I don't know. Why are they like horizontal? He, he for sure rebuilt her in SD. <laughs> <laughs> like what the shit? I've never seen anybody that looks like that in my what? whole life. I'm confused about the mechanics <laughs> I don't of the know. earlobes. I don't know what to say. This doctor like straight out. He just pulled it all down. Should not be a doctor. Yeah. How is this healthy? Like, if he is a doctor, oh, we couldn't okay. find anything. Mm-hmm. You couldn't learn anything about him. We I looked we around included, too. Yeah. Yeah. We all looked. His WhatsApp is the only link he has connected, and <laughs> he has no bio, and his WhatsApp bio is just, hello. Right. <laughs> but his, like, his TikTok bio says no bio yet. Like, he typed that in. Here's and, the thing. These surgeries are definitely happening. Like, I don't know who this Dr. Kim is, but these are real people having hello. their faces cut off. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, but can it, can it... Last a few years, are they gonna be okay? Nobody knows, man. <laughs> so here's this lady. She's you know definitely got some age. Here she is. Honestly, on. that one's pretty nuts. Like, hello, youthful, la- <laughs> hello, youthful glowing. queen. Incredible. She's ready to mingle now. I think these are all so, good. 
Y'all are just haters. I mean, to be real though, this one is kind of impressive. Mm-hmm. <laughs> they just like had four people just pulling their skin back <laughs> on her face. Yeah. It's, gonna crack. Yeah. it's just like setting a drum. Yeah, it looks good, Doctor. I can't feel my face though. Yeah. Well, I when we oh wait, I'm about to spoil something. Never mind. Mm. Three days after. Oh, that's three days after. She's healing great. Yeah. If you go to his page, it's all just straight bananas. Let's see. I saw some people saying that even his profile picture is generic. It's probably mm. not him. If you do do a reverse en- image search for his profile picture. Because okay. his the picture is like a really nice, generic, young, professional-looking doctor. Yeah. And I know that's not Dr. Right, Kim. Right, that's not Dr. Kim. This dude is not Dr. That's Kim. A stock photo. Mm. For all I know, these people could be kidnapped and the subject <laughs> oh, of Jesus. human experimentation. I, yeah. That might be what's happening here. This one is. Let's see, seven. Before. What? I mean, what the fuck? This one's kind of impressive, Wait, too. Yeah, that isn't one. It? It's it's less that it looks bad. It's more is that really the same person? It looks like a different person. Yeah, great. <laughs> well, that <laughs> just funny in a different way. Yeah, is it? It might be though. I, I think it's know. the same person. I think well, it's maybe the same. We're, uh, she everything yeah. about her. Everything looks different. Dude, look, he cut her neck. He t- yeah. cut her skin at the fucking neck. Ugh. I mean, I think they do that. This dude cut all around her face. Holy smokes, man. Oh, uh, my God. It's fucking face off, dude. Absolutely. This lady is from South Korea. She found us on TikTok and saw her smile. It was all worth it. Okay, so really? she... F- so that doesn't make sense. Oh, that's the description. He it says she found it. him on TikTok, yet we can't find any way to get a hold of him or find out anything about him. Well, she probably WhatsApped him. Yeah, I think... What's so up? let's WhatsApp him and see... You wanna? I, I can WhatsApp him. him. I'd like to just know more about him. Just say, hey, we run the big, a huge podcast. I'll do it right now. Influential podcast. And we'd love to talk about your professional, uh, love to. Love to, love to, love to. <laughs> okay. Ethan. I found mm-hmm. another doctor with, that's, yeah, that's not his name. So that's a stolen profile picture. Yeah. Which is mm-hmm. shady as a mother. This whole thing. This is so like surgery in the back of a truck. Yeah. It's so uh, shady. These are real surgeries, and you have someone with a fake picture posting that it was him. She found him on TikTok. That's the same person. You can tell. Where? Where can you tell? The nose, uh, the eyes. Yeah, yeah. It's the same person. All right, well, I mean, I feel like this one isn't that bad. I think what uh, there's a lot going on. There's some like filters she, going on on the after. She became like a too young. Mm. She has you the know? same left nostril. She's like 12 now. Yeah. <laughs> That's definitely her. Yeah. I think there's some uh, filter because it, in all the befores, you can see like all their pores and shit. Uh-huh. And then the after, it's like all of a sudden mm-hmm. he, he did. Yeah. What you he remove your pores too? No. There's some flattery going on here for sure. Mm. But, um, well, another success story by Dr. Kim. Let's keep looking as I am endlessly fascinated. Look at this. Oh. That's a dub. button that because I just I button that because last time that happened just showing that yeah, yeah. screen yeah that's silly it is so <laughs> dumb. so silly nothing was even shown yeah but, okay sorry about that folks so, at least uh we didn't give you um a light show this time true <laughs> this one's so here she is I mean let's be uh, you know she's you know not quite sure What language are they speaking? Give me the volume. Oh, Uh, (laughs) yeah. She's saying, "Help me, please." I'm. I'm pretty. I'm at two one three seven Wolf Street. I think this is all in South Korea. 
But why would she say she's from South Korea? If if it's all in South Korea, I feel like this is in China. Oh, maybe there's there's got to be somewhere with like very little medical oversight. Not that China is has no medical oversight, but I feel like that country's so big and there's so much going on there. And there's there's a lot of you know. The reason I suggested South Korea on top of the fact that there's several of these that said that they were Korean is that um. Well, what we were looking this, this up the other day. Uh, I looked up the stats, and South Korea has the highest plastic surgery rate no. per capita in the world. So they, they are I, into their matter. plastic surgery. Their plastic right. surgery is really I've good. I've heard though. about that. Like I, it's crazy they good. They look very natural. Like you couldn't really tell. Totally. Like they're experts at it, evidently. Yeah. It's like you know um, when we get our braces, everybody just accepts that as normal. I think I feel like in South Korea, it's like that for like do their nose. And their eyelids I and shit. Have, it's crazy. The, the photo I found of the actual doctor, he, well, the address they have is in South Korea. Oh, yeah. shit. So this dude is actually butchering people in South Korea. Well, I, I mean, the. No, no, the, yeah, the, the, the stolen profile picture yeah. was uh, from a Korean doctor. Doesn't really mean anything. Yeah, yeah that's. So who knows? But. I, because I do think Korean plastic surgeons are very uh, well renowned, or a lot of them anyway. I said no pickles. What language is it? What, what, what the fuck, Google? I think it's I Mandarin. Fuck. God damn. People are saying he's in Shanghai. So that's... Perhaps. He, his first Face TikTok lifts are, It's is, in Chinese. It's in Chinese. Yeah, that's, mm. that's in China. His first TikTok is geotagged to Singapore. Oh. oh. They speak Mandarin, Chinese, and Singapore? Uh, Singapore actually... Uh, <laughs> its main language is English. Um, but I, I think there's... I think... This it's dude's in Cantonese China. I'm telling you, this dude's in China. The look what he look at this shit. Spoken there, bro. Come on. Oh, come on. Whoa! Ah! Oh my god! Oh my god! Ah! It's one of four official languages spoke in Singapore. Oh, okay. I this dude's in China though. Oh, is this Doctor Kim? Oh. That looks like Doctor Kim. Oh my god, those scars. Wait, is this the same account? I think you might have. Oh shit. This is somebody else. Yeah, this is somebody else. Oh. So wait, is this a fad? Oh yeah, because his looked more... Oh, okay. so I don't people do it. <laughs> uh, his didn't look as crazy. This account has look, very see? gory stuff on it. Just oh. FYI. Yeah, these ones look way... I mean, wow, that's pretty intense. Pretty intense. Wait, then how the fuck... Oh, because I just searched for facelift in Chinese. That'll do it. Thank you. All right, let's see. Who People else. are saying they're Chinese trying to seem Korean with fake photo slash name. Uh, oh, maybe because South Korea has a good reputation uh -huh. for yeah. surgery, they're trying to portray that. Bro, why is what? What the fuck? Okay, hold on. I don't want to be mean, but I mean, who, don't I'm be gonna, mean. She's in China. She doesn't has no idea who I am or never see this. <laughs> <laughs> but like, you know, when you're fucking around and like. I mean, I say this, but it really is a Wii avatar, like when you make the cheeks all big. This is the before, by the way, so I'm just being a dick. <laughs> exactly. She's in the, she's, what she's doing, she's in the cre uh, character creation right now. There it is. Okay. That one isn't that bad. It's not I that mean, bad. not great, but. I liked her better before. Yeah, I apologize. I was just saying, she has puffy cheeks, that's all. Like in a good way, like a beautiful. Well, she was insecure about it enough to go get surgery, thanks to people like you. <laughs> she, <laughs> I mean, she could probably stash so many acorns All in right. those things. I All right, clap think... those cheeks. <gasps> oh, oh my oh, God, Ducky, he was under your chair. Oh. Oh my God. Jeez. Oh shit. What is everybody yelling? T U V video or tub video? What is this? Did he poop himself? Poor thing. He he does that sometimes. He gets all curled up under the chair. Oh. Poor thing. Alfredo's checking on him. <laughs> oh. What a you sweetheart. Okay, no. okay. Is he okay? Here. You want to go set him on? Come. <laughs> <Bart>? go, go, go. <laughs>
<laughs> Probably got spooked mostly Dude, from what I saw. I've always been so scared of that I know. happening. I know. Fuck. I just moved back a tiny bit. It must have went pinched on his him. But I, I don't think his feet. I think he's okay. From what I saw, he just got spooked. Yeah. I'm touching his feet to see if he is feeling any pain. I think mm -hmm. he's okay. Yeah, he'd be yelping yeah. when you yeah. squeeze it like that. Oh, so now he's just hamming it up for attention. Hey. Like, oh, yeah. oh, poor me. So oh, poor me. It's not fair that that happened. It's so not fair. That should never happen. Who the hell's throwing tomatoes for Ducky in the chat? Someone said dead bear. Fuck off. <laughs> Better than dead dog. <laughs> <laughs> You're Alfredo now. Hi, Alfredo. He's the best, by the way. He's such a good dog. <laughs> Ducky? Yeah. He's so cute and so sweet and so yeah. smart. Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, I was inspired by Dr. Kim. I could watch these all day, frankly. <laughs> um, and maybe we will, but... Um, I've been inspired by his artistry. Have you? Yeah, you can see what what some what just a little bit of good work can do for a person. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I've been on this journey of self improvement. I've lost weight. I got a haircut. Mm -hmm. I'm wearing pants. Mm -hmm. Wow! And, you know, yeah. there, there's Most one impressive of all. There yeah, is the one pants? final frontier. Okay. My face. Really? People always say you can't fit. You know, you got a face only a mother could love. You know, you can't change your face, they says. Can't change ugly. You can't fix ugly. Who says that? Well, I posture. What okay. if you could? Mm. Go ahead, Ian. Anyway, get a load of what Myron says. He keeps calling me ugly and he keeps calling Ela ugly. Bullying Whatever. keeps people in fucking check. Get the fuck out of here if you don't like getting bullied. Go to fucking H3. What? I don't know. Someone needs to bully fucking Ethan class so he can lose some goddamn weight and get away from that ugly bitch that he's married to. I mean, you know what? It's like, oh, why do I care what bullies think? You know, <laughs> I'm successful. I'm mature. I've got kids. I've got a wife. Like, I couldn't care less about what this guy thinks about me. All right. Well, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Thank you guys. Thank you. Good work today, everyone. Too, Good work, Olivia. Thank High you, five. You too, always. Ian, great switching today, buddy. Appreciate it. You that nailed was, it. That was really funny. You Good nailed stuff, it. Man. You're the man. You too. Go to fucking H3. What? I don't know. Someone needs to bully and fucking hit the class so he can lose some goddamn weight. He's fat. He's short. He's clearly lonely. He's wearing fucking baggy ass shorts. He finally took off the mask. Let's go dream. Let's hope uh, Ethan Klein takes his off next. Oh, I'm being told that's his actual, that's his actual face. I'm so sorry, Ethan. Oh, fuck. I wish I was more beautiful. Oh, what can I do? This is the face I was born with. There's gotta be a better way. God damn, look at that ugly mug. Fuck me, dude. Okay, I gotta do something about this. I need to go see Dr. Kim. He'll know what to do. Hello. Good afternoon. Hi, can I help you? Can you help me? What are you talking about? Ethan? What happened? What are you talking about? Why are you looking at me like that? I have done nothing to my face. <laughs> I didn't, okay. I have done no work on my face, Dan. Yeah, okay. That, that, that explains it. I understand that you're anxious being around someone this hot. Well, you're gonna have to get over it. And now that I'm hot, like nine out of 10, Maybe 10 out of 10. The interior me is still the same, okay? Yeah, of course, of course. All right. Yeah, I'm sorry. I right, found it, bro. Yeah. Nice to see you. <laughs> good to see you. Good morning, everybody. Nice to see y'all. Good morning. Y'all good? <gasps> oh my God. What happened? Are you okay? Do you need me to call medical attention? Does that hurt? I'm fine. You guys are tripping, dude. I, I don't know what y'all, are talking about, stop looking at me, okay? I've had no work done. I've done nothing, okay? I've been doing kegels and other cheek exercises. Kegels with your... It, it connects, it's a chi thing, you don't understand. So you like how you look? What do you mean by that? Do I ask you how do you like how you look when you look in the mirror? I don't look like that. Zach, what's up? You look awesome, dude. You look 20 years younger. That's my boy right there. Thank you, I've been doing kegels. Looking great. 
good. Is that the Dior lip oil? It is. How did you, that's what I it is. I knew. I knew as soon as you walked in. Olivia, what's up? Any hey. PowerPoints in the works? Not today. What's what's different? Yeah, I don't know. It's a good hair day, I guess. Love. Hey, what's good, baby? What are we eating for lunch, brother? I don't know, dude. I don't know if I'm that hungry anymore. All right. Well, let me know when you're hungry, okay? Yep, yeah, buddy. Sure. Sure, dude. What's up, Cam? What are you working on? Just you know, drawing some cool monsters and stuff. Oh, dude, that's sick. It's a whole book of monsters, right? Yeah. Actually, can you stay there? You look pretty inspiring today. You're not drawing in that book, though. Hey, why not? You're, you're a work of art. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Go ahead. Man. How did they notice that I got work done? I thought it was so subtle. It looks so natural. I need to go back to Dr. Kim to do, try this again and to get it perfect. I'm going to do that. Oh, here it oh. is. Oh. <laughs> you look gorgy. Wow. Oh my God. Wow. wow. <laughs> For real? Thank you, Dr. Kim. Oh, we love he's you. He's a miracle mm -hmm. worker. I, I seriously look like at least 20 years younger. Literally. At least. Yeah, touch it. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Touch it. <laughs> Go ahead. I was touching it earlier. It's interesting. It doesn't, it, it doesn't feel like skin. <laughs> it's weird. I yeah. don't think it is actually. I think it was. Um, is it skin? Because it, it I didn't think feel it's some like other it material that they that they use for that. Because they they get rid of so much skin, there's really none left. Huh. Mm. God. Wow. But <sighs> you guys, you know, and and by the way, it was only like two hundred dollars. So. Mm. Two hundred. The very affordable option. Oh whoa! Well, we turned into beautiful world. How did you get lipstick you wanted... transfer to your hand like that? <laughs> you keep doing that. Doing whoa. <laughs> Oh, oh no! Oh my God! Me Eva. too. You look amazing. <laughs> oh, I love. Have you been to Doctor Kim? <laughs> um, maybe. You know. Natural beauty. You look like a brat doll. Uh, yeah, that's what I was thinking. You look like a brat doll. A brat. Thank you so Talk much. To Talk to me, baby. I mean, I just asked for like a natural look. Mm -hmm. Just we just did like a tiny bit of of uh, buckle removal. God, I love it. Yeah, that's <laughs> right. We did one tiny procedure. We just took a little buckle fat out. That's cool. That's cool. Yeah. Well, I just so so willing to talk about it. So yeah. open about it. It's really now well, the firing. results are hard to yeah. hard to argue with. Oh my god. <laughs> so there it is, everybody. We're back. We're shooting sketches now. You understand what I'm saying? You understand? <laughs> People say, "Where's my membership money go to?" To these huge budget <laughs> production <laughs> Yeah, schedules. big budget stuff here. That's Project right. surgery, oh. plastic surgery ain't cheap. Yeah. By the way, Sam, bucks. Sam got me good because she she did the prosthetics and she put all this glue on my face. Mm -hmm. And then before it was time to remove it, she's like, I got to go, but here's the, here's the stuff to remove. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. It was so fucked. Oh my god. There was so much shit glued on my face. <laughs> and I was just scrubbing. There was like oil and alcohol and all this crazy oh. shit. I didn't know what was that. Um, and I was just scrubbing. My skin was like turning red. It was whole crazy. I had glue stuck in my beard. <laughs> it's horrible. We but got they, a lot of it in the behind the scenes of you trying to get it mm. on. <laughs> oh, there Which it is. Be going behind up the scenes. End of the episode today. After today's episode. Thank you, AB. Mm. Behind the scenes is back. Uh, but Lena and Olivia were uh, saviors. <laughs> you guys helped me out. Thank nice. you. No. Anytime. Anytime. Should we try the Ann brothers? And oh, sons? yes. I had to move mm, away yeah. because of that. So he told me this is the uh, the Valentine's Day collection. Mm. So, Valentine's Day. So yeah. This so this. Soon. You know. Still not being paid by them. Have a little aphrodisiac them, uh, effect on. On y'all, little Viagra in there. Oops. Oh, those are nice looking. This chocolate box. Dude. Oh, this is all of them. Love. So here, take one. Yeah, here. Love. <laughs> Let's see. Now I'll say. They, oh, AB, you may want this. The Ansons is very expensive, and I saw people. Some people saying, I mean, so a lot of people love it, but some people saying love. it wasn't worth the money. So I just want to say, first of all, I have no vested interest in you buying any of this. <laughs> so like, if you don't want to spend a shitload of money on chocolate, just know that some people didn't think it was worth it. <laughs> you, right? I mean, 
Okay. I, I just a disclaimer, like if you're like, damn, I really want to try that, but I don't have money. Just it's probably not worth it. With peace and love to the sons. It's definitely a luxury. Yeah. Uh, it's a luxury item, yeah, uh, for sure. But yeah. that said, it is really everything cool. I've had from them so far. Oh, they're so insane. cute. Yeah, it's good for like a birthday, maybe. Yeah, kind of so type deal. Definitely for Valentine's just like Day. a bottle of wine or champagne. Yeah. It's like, yeah, yeah, you could you could get the two buck chuck. Right. Let's That's see. so cute what with the heart. Here. Salted caramel. Let's go. That's my f shit, mm. dude. Well, what is that one? The s'mores one. Let's see. Oh, oh there there are two. You want to strawberry caramel? champagne? Oh, strawberry you. champagne. All different flavors. Try the one with the hearts. Love. Which one oh my do God. I want? Dan, that one you gave me just now? Which is a new one? I'm just eating it too. Fuck. The one you just oh, ate is new. No. It's such a um, burn, almost like shard caramel in a weird mm. way. Salted caramel, that's the one you go for? We both just had it. And it's so good. If I'm you like mine. that. It's not not everybody likes salted caramel, but I love, I love it. it. This is my shit, dude. The strawberry champagne is so mm. good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It, that's jelly. Do you like Pop the jelly? One? I like that one. Oh my God. I don't know if it was, it wasn't jelly. Uh-huh. It didn't have that chewy texture. It was more like a liquid. Maybe. <laughs> I feel like. Mm -hmm. What else we got in here? He knows better than to serve me chili. I mean jelly. Popcorn? There's a popcorn one? Wait, popcorn? I'm slamming that right butter now. Butter? It's so fucking good. Oh, I love butter, butter popcorn. The popcorn sure is so good, dude. Oh, buttered this? popcorn. Yeah. Hmm. Here's. Let's share it. Good idea. You wanna try it? These things are so heavy, like. Yeah. Hmm. Butter popcorn. Oh, I like that. Yeah, that's refreshing. That's fun. Mm, that's good. Mm. What else is in here? That's Mango really white sesame. Interesting. <coughs> Strawberry champagne. You mentioned that one. Macadamia lemon meringue. <coughs> Coconut almond. Uh, striped hazelnut. Gianduja. <coughs> What's what the that coconut? I'm gonna try the coconut one. Then I'm out. The popcorn one is really good. Coconut. What oh, are you looking for? Coconut? There's one I really didn't like. Oh, what? It tastes like the inside of a men's restroom. What? Which one? I want to try it. <laughs> what the fuck? That's the only way I can describe it. <laughs> what Which was, one it? was it? I want to try one it. Which one was that? It was the urinal cake one. <laughs> <laughs> it was passion <laughs> orange was and guava. Cake. Yeah. Uh, Jeff just donated, by the way. <laughs> just Mark, oh, whatever. Glad. Don't. And son's Mark Jeff. Mark Jeff. Do we think Wait. that that's really him, or is yeah. that just... You think so? <laughs> yeah. Yo? Probably. Yo! Would he write yo? <laughs> He's well, just figuring it out. Listen, uh, Mark Jeff, with peace and love, apparently one tastes like a urinal. According to Zach, wait, wait, which we one need is it, to Zach? try it. Yeah. It's the guava. Which one was it? Passion. Oh, he uh, he became a member. He, he actually orange did guava. Oh. oh, that is him. He did the twenty dollar a month membership. He said. Oh, oh my god, we yeah. love you. He's a uh, an absolute They're... legend, I believe. Is that cheer? Okay. Uh, sorry, Mike. Uh, Jeff Daniel. Jeff Daniel. <laughs> loved your work in <laughs> Big Lebowski. What? Jeff Daniel. <laughs> Mark Jeff. So this one, apparently, according to Zach, tastes like a men's restaurant. Men's. It's not a piss taste. It's like a fragrance, like they'd have in a men's. This restaurant. is passion. Oh, okay. Well, that's a big guava. difference. Yeah. So it's mm. you're, you're insane. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's you like that's it? true, but you know, but not because of this. Yeah, it's good. It's good. Mm -hmm. okay. I didn't. I didn't like it. But... Passion orange. Maybe it smells like here. some kind of it perfume. Maybe it's invoking like Febreze. Yeah, I can see that. It's yeah. nice and floral though. It's good. That's very nice, Theodore. Would yeah, he loves that. Love mm. Theodore loves oh, yeah, passion no, fruit. This I eat that good. men's restroom all day. Different like flavors. All right, thank you, um, Mark Jeff. It's always a pleasure. <laughs> I got to meet the other brother, by the way. Are you gay? I never met him. Yeah. Is he cool? Yeah. Is he weird? No. Not weird. No. The vibes were okay. Yeah. You didn't ask about. You didn't think about asking him to leave. <laughs> no. Okay. You're talking about sure. the other son. I just haven't met him yeah. before, so. I met him too. Oh, He's you okay. Too. Yeah. Okay, he seemed fine. Yeah. Yeah. If anything, Mark Jeff is the weird one, you know? <laughs> He's the weird brother. True. Just kidding. Love you. Love Although you, it's Jeff. funny because I feel like the one that we've been <laughs> talking to is the one I haven't met. The one you've been... Wait, what do you mean? Where? I met talking Mark where? Jeff. Yeah. Jeff. Mark Jeff. But his brother, I haven't met. And that's no. the guy we're mostly been talking to. Oh, it? I see. I see. Gotcha. We gotcha. met him. They came in last week. Yeah, they stopped by hello. the studio. Was there a smell when he was here? <laughs> 
Like good chocolate. It smelled fucking dank, dude. Okay. Like they had just <laughs> fucking ripped a fat blunt right before walking in. It was crazy. Mm. That's that and bros. They're yeah. crazy like that. <laughs> All right. Nice. Thank you, brothers. Sons. Always bring in the, the chocolatey, yummy goodness. And I meant no disrespect by uh, tasting like Febreze. Of course. Like- I, appreciate the, <laughs> I appreciate the honesty. You know, we got to keep yeah. it real. If they, want, if they want me to lie, they have to pay me. <laughs> right, I mean, right. I mean, it's fucking nice. That's for fair. To, that's fair. To bring us all this shit, but uh, no disrespect. It's all. Of it's all. It is a beautiful box, by the way. I mean, it was an adventurous flavor. I'll give you that. And not everybody <laughs> likes citrus mixed with chocolate. You know, maybe that's just not for you. Yeah, yeah. Um, alrighty. All right, we got to talk about both of the things in our title before it gets too late. <laughs> is that right? Yeah, Doug David Dobrik Dubrick. and Ben Shapiro. And Ben Shapiro. <laughs> all right, let's do that then. <laughs> Death All to the right. Jews, death to Israel. Easy, dude. Whoa, Ben. Okay, he's gone off the deep end. He's he's actually switched teams. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> he's actually he says I'm going. I'm decided that Hamas is my calling. He's joining. Akbar, death to America. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Uh, so which one me, you want to do, David? Let's do Dubrick. Uh, let's do Dubrick. Dubrick. Let me see. Where is that dang thing? <laughs> Here, so Jason Nash, as everybody knows by now, <laughs> has gained a reputation for, and I mean this with all, with all sincerity, and I mean this no. in, in the meanest, unmeanest way possible. Only with peace and love. I, like I don't, I'm not trying to make a like this dude is at rock bottom. Like this dude is down. Bad, and I do not want to make him feel worse. <laughs> he does still live. <laughs> he still lives in a mansion. I don't believe. You. I mean, damn, he's got he's got a pretty young wife that was basically Ben Affleck was in, interested in. Um, that's right? a W. Oh, oh, me. oh! He needs to it's the, it's keep me, providing, girl. Right? She needs to keep it's providing. Me. Why did you unmatch me? Nobody wants to be married to a, a unemployed, you know, loser. And I'm so not he's saying he's a rock loser. bottom, though. He's got a, uh, he's got a house, new relationship. A, yeah, newlywed. Mm-hmm. He, he, he mentioned he wife. can't pay his mortgage. <laughs> he has a winner's <laughs> attitude. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, Ninja. <laughs> yeah, Tyler. Well, anyway, uh, I'm happy for all of his success. That being said, everybody has, knows him now uh, for. Uh, Begging for money on TikTok mm. Live, and really, it is really a sight to see. Money, and I, no money. I've just been questioning David as a as a friend, as a person. I know he doesn't pay any of the Vlog Squad members, and they're all doing their own thing. But of all of them, Jason is the one that's been there with him, that's ridden with him, mm-hmm. and also who's just doesn't have much talent beyond what they. And I mean that with all peace and love. He doesn't have much talent beyond what David can use him for. I mean, you could say that about everybody, no? In the vlog squad? You couldn't say that about Jeff Wittick. Sure. He's not in, he was not in the vlog squad already, though. But, um... Oh, that's an interesting situation. <laughs> no ice on the bottom. <laughs> I like that. Thank you. Can I get a little tidbit of that live on TikTok? Because I haven't seen it. Yeah. What everybody's talking yeah. about. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's okay, good. Here's Tana talking about it recently, and we'll we'll get pull up clips of that. But there's anyway, David made a comment about it. That's what this is all leading to. And it's you know Can someone crazy. make Jason Nash a fucking DoorDash account? If I open my TikTok <laughs> one more time to seeing him begging for roses on my live for you page, I'm calling CPS. <laughs> Have you seen your kids? <laughs> Have you seen them? And also when they go to school. Are their friends like, hey, I saw your dad, like, begging for a galaxy. Like, and I'm, I know I'm a sellout, okay? I'm not against people doing things for money, but at this point, it's like, I would rather see him behind a paywall, cheeked up. Like, <laughs> I just, I just don't get, I just, every single time I've opened my phone, Jason Nash is on live begging for money. And I want answers. <laughs> Have you seen your kids this month? That, that part I don't, I don't agree with and I don't get. Yeah, because. Everybody's got to work. People will say that to me whenever yeah. I'll post like a photo shoot or something and they're like, go be with your kids. And it's like, I am with my kids. Shut up. Everybody's I working. also work. I do stuff. Welcome to the modern world. So, 
it's a little sensitive spot as well, a parent to hear somebody say that and to being real parent. about that aspect whatever he's doing probably enables him to have more time with his kids right. if anything kids are probably trying to get away from him right <laughs> <laughs> exactly but she's so funny but that was a very was funny uh, <laughs> delivery yeah it was good um so there's a phenomenon TikTok live battles they're essentially real-time competitions between two streamers where the winner is decided by the viewers decided by who gets the most money from sticker donations mm. and stuff like that. Let me see. Do we have a... Do we have... I need clips of him competing. Uh, yeah, one second. And it's like, he's, when, he's doing this all the time. Really? Like, this is his full-time job. And you can even hear him talking about it. He's like, I have to... He's doing this to pay his bills, quote-unquote. I just think the other thing too is, is like you have children so yes. it's like that's the thing too i think a lot of people don't realize that it's like you have kids and i you know you you need to support your children somehow 100 percent. i i literally would do only fans to support my kids wait, wait when you the know, comments, like i do anything yeah. Yeah, like uh, like i don't know i love he's like listen i gotta go live and beg for my like, i have to do something <laughs> well here's the question do we i mean is he making a decent amount of money doing this? I have no idea, but I can't imagine it's very good. So it's got to be like close to minimum wage. He talks about TikTok help, helping him out. Like they offered him some sort of deal the same way Snapchat does. Oh my yeah. God. They I mean, pay him to do this. He's got a contract and they're like paying him to do this. That's kind of different. Imagine. That's different than like doing it, making barely minimum wage, mm -hmm. at which point just go, go apply job. for a job at Home yeah. Depot, man. Like. Just get a real job. Yeah, it must be more than that. Yeah, because he has a very expensive house. Like, like uh, he's saying he can't afford it anymore. Right, but it's like super expensive. How much? How much was it? I don't. It's like a very big house in L.A. Let me I see. I mean, that's expensive. So, regardless, of well, let's see. At least a Nash no? house. Having kids yeah, in general no, no, no. is so expensive. Um, his house. Oh, one point three million. I mean, right. That seems reasonable, and with what he's been through. Yeah. He could I mean, sell after that his live. whole career, if he can't afford a $1.3 million house with the exposure sure. and all the shit that he's done with David, who's like a multi, multi, multi millionaire, right. that's fucked up, in my opinion. No, I, I agree with your point. I know it's a lot of money, right? I'm not saying it's not, but y'all, Dave, if David is worth like $50 million plus dollars and Jason can't afford his mortgage, you know. Anyway, here. You said earlier, somebody said, um, why does he just get a door dash whatever right like do you ever think about going at, to door dash or to like a you know did you ever think about going back to like any other job or was like well, i can't an do anything else or, or just like i love yeah electrician obviously you do lives with him um i don't know just i just never thought it's like it's like it, it's entertainment or nothing i don't care what it is this is, is the is question like, that every youtuber never wants to hear ever this is the question. Why don't you just do something? When else? are you, you need to go apply for a job somewhere? Mm -hmm. You this is no longer a viable career option for you. It's honestly probably why a lot of people when they're up will go into like investing in creating their own product or a brand. Absolutely. Or something because you kind of have to Prepare yourself for that day to come. I can't imagine there's much. And have something else you can do. You gotta be ready. You gotta you prepare gotta for that day. Yeah. Because the thing is, there's gotta be nothing worse than being famous and broke. Right. Imagine seeing Jason Nash, like, you know, bagging yeah. groceries. Not that that's not an admirable job, but imagine every day people being like, holy shit, is Jason Nash? Mm -hmm. Dude, you're bagging groceries? What the fuck? What are you doing here? <laughs> that would be rough. Just nonstop, yeah. everyday humiliation. <laughs> But it seems I like he, that's suggest... what he's already getting just for doing TikTok Live, which I, I still haven't seen those. We're but... gonna, I'll show you. I'm gonna show you. I sent one. They do. No, no, I'm, no. It's, <laughs> it's just that, no, I'm, 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 genuinely, I'm genuinely asking because anytime I see one, the comments are like, why doesn't he like work like a real job? Like, this right. isn't me saying this as a negative thing. Yes, I'm yes, just no, totally asking. This guy's kind of wild for this question, but I appreciate it. He's like, bro, everybody's telling you that you need to get a job. Does he answer? I'm curious. Yeah, he does. Yeah, yeah. Why don't I get a real job? No. 
your question. No, 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 no. You know not, not to be offensive or anything, but why don't you give up? <laughs> no, that's why not. Why don't you give up? That's really not. I'm genuinely asking because there's the comments I see. I know why you do it. Yeah. But like, say that is okay. You know what? Just flavor it like that. Like that. Why don't you get a real job? Uh. I don't have any skills. <laughs> okay. That's the boogie. That's the boogie excuse. Right. Right. Well, he literally did, the same thing. Well, hold on. Boogie, do you have advice for Jason? Let's say he goes uh, to a recruiter. I did work at a small gaming store back in... Okay. I could say that. 2006, okay, you could buy a gaming store. I am disabled. Uh, uh, recognized by the state of Arkansas, but also well, the United States government. Well, Jason's not disabled. There's that. Now, not the, that we the know. The downside of that is I am extremely depressed. So there's some That's mental probably, health issues that we bring to the table. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And then physically, uh, I, I am morbidly obese. I have no references, I mean, it's uh, good. no work good history, yeah. and no education. And when you Google my name, you might see rumors that I beat my ex-wife. Whoa, and whoa, I, whoa. Oh, whoa. Well, she admits what? that I'm also a felon. <laughs> whoa, no, Jason, you don't have to say that. About two years. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, it sounds like Jason's got it easy. Compared to Boogie? Yeah. Well, yeah, Boogie is kind of in a world of his own. Jason's of able body, able mind, you know? I'm ready to send his ass to the front line, boy. Can you hold a gun? Can you march? It's time to fight for freedom somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> I don't see that's why someone someone said that the other day. Why don't you get into real estate? I'm like, I hate it. I don't have a real Bo, estate. Bo Granny, what's his name? Do you have any interests um, outside of entertainment? Um, no. Okay. I big, mean, I, big I don't, golfer. I can't golf. Okay. I mean, do you know how humiliating this is? That he went on this podcast. He's probably doing these guys a favor, and now they're they're having an intervention where they're all suggesting different <laughs> professions he could uh, potentially exit into. You know, like this guy's coming on here to promote his entertainment career. What I'm, what's left of it? And <laughs> people are like, "You gotta hang it up." Bro. Wait, is this not? This is his podcast. Oh, it's is on it? His channel. Oh, it is on his channel. Okay, I feel okay. like he. Well, there it to... is. Thirteen thousand views in four days. That mm-hmm. man needs to go to fucking. <laughs> he needs to go to the recruiter. I feel like he wanted to address it, and he may have even prepped mm-hmm. him to ask him. Yeah, okay, yeah, that's okay. possible. He uploaded this on his channel, mm-hmm. motherfucker. He has ads. Thirteen thousand views, and Seat Geeks paying him. <laughs> but I see this happen all the time. What the fuck? Like I see it on Housewives. Somebody will get a divorce, and then it's for the first time in their life they're on their own. Mm-hmm. So it's like David and so was his it's sugar like, mama. They go and figure out a new career, and they you have to put some work, and you got to choose maybe study something. If you, I, real estate is something you could study and go do in like a year, it's not mm-hmm. that difficult to get into it. Um, no, it's possible. Pro- it's possible to to kick off something. You can of crush in real estate, and with his reputation, he might be able to recruit some some clientele right out the. You right. know, people might get a kick out of mm-hmm. working with him. Well, celebrity, uh, yeah, real estate. Mm-hmm. You know, what, would I, what would I do? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I was about to say live stream it, but no, never mind. I, mean, I, I hope and, that didn't come off as like these guys. Apparent these, they know him. These are like his friends. He does a show with. So if anybody knows how down bad he is, it's them. If he, if they know how, they're the ones that would know how dire his situation is. And so when they're like, you need to get a fucking another job. Then you know shit's crazy. A negative thing. I no, was no, no. Asking... I, I like what you're doing. You're you're posing the question of what everyone's thinking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which is good. <laughs> <laughs> what a piece. Of... You're saying what <laughs> is on everybody's mind. I'm just. I, yeah. I saw I saw a comment. So I was like, oh, I'm gonna ask him because people are. You know, I don't know. I just see it as straight talking Zach. You know. Yeah. 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 Straight. Yo, and what are they? They gotta split the. the I mean, I this what, revenue's getting split four ways with thirteen thousand <laughs> views. Are they guests? I can't tell what's happening. I don't know, actually. Or, don't know. I have no idea. How much? Okay. It's like 50 bucks. <laughs> he said, I mean, I don't know if you passed on it. On a good day. He, it's how much he makes on a live, probably. Yeah. <laughs> he what? said it's not profitable yet. He said he's hoping by next year it will be. A year? Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. I don't... Um... Maybe we can keep it floating with the TikTok money. It, again, I, don't, I just don't look at it. No, my, my, my opinion not, on all of this listen. depends on how much he's making from this TikTok thing. Because, <laughs> mm-hmm. like, yeah, it's kind of embarrassing to be begging for money on TikTok, but if he's making, 
you know, a couple grand a day doing no, it. No, no way. Okay. No shot. <laughs> I, I have no like, idea. I in the beginning, there are people that can pull crazy numbers, mm -hmm. but he's doing it every day. There's return diminishing returns big time. Like, there's <laughs> right, nobody left. Right. Bro, I saw him on live with like a hundred fucking viewers begging for money from a hundred transient TikTok scrollers. <laughs> okay. <laughs> do what you gotta do, I guess. And again, like, I'm not if this was anybody, I would I you know, I love the hustle, appreciate the hustle. It's the fact that David Dobrik this man's supposed best friend threw him out like a used tampon. Is that okay to say? Or is that chauvinistic? I mean, I, you do throw away tampons when you're done using them. Yeah. I don't feel like that's chauvinistic. Like a used baby wipe is more gen. I guess it's You could say sure. it about anything. I don't know yeah. why. I like yeah. the, you could say I just, used tampon. People I like say that. it. It's so right. vulgar and graphic. Female <laughs> vaginas are yeah. disgusting. It's pretty gross if you're going gross. to gross. Yeah. Female vaginas are disgusting. Just look at it like. <laughs> Go ahead. What? Female vaginas are disgusting. <laughs> was that Myron who said that? That is Myron. Man, he is totally straight. A lot going on in the psyche uh, of that man. Play a fucking Halo! Somebody called Breakfast Burrito, which I love. What a great name. Said, oh, that's their name. <laughs> no, that's just their username. <laughs> <laughs> said, offer him a deal. He can spill the tea about David. Interesting. <laughs> Jason, <laughs> I'll hire you and I'll pay you a good salary. <laughs> Whatever you're making from your podcast and TikTok live, I'll double it. Assuming it's not a lot, which I don't think it is. <laughs> talk, but, contact, let's talk. But with the condition Tip. that you sell out your best friend. <laughs> best quote unquote best friend. Yeah, you have I mean, to sell it. You have to sell him out all the secrets, basically. Be you gotta humiliated. know all the dirt. I also, like we already yeah. know everything. Yeah, what? But maybe you know not. Shit. Jason knows shit. Also, you're gonna have to wear a um, He's live chicken right now, people suit. say. Oh, give me the link. You're gonna have to wear a chicken <laughs> suit, and we will occasionally drop buckets of tar on you. Ooh, Riley it's said Jason is worse than a used tampon. At least the tampon worked. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Shit, dude. <laughs> Discarded like a defective <laughs> tampon. <laughs> True, that's a good point, actually. I, 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 okay, I'm gonna open this link because I'm curious. But guys, do not. I'm not. And please don't go harass him. This is not what I'm trying to do. This is not what I want to happen. I'm just genuinely curious. Oh, he's got a thousand people watching. He's doing it right now. Eli, here. This is the perfect. Okay. Let me see. You're private, but you're not showing up. What and is he's, this about? He's always in his kitchen. Okay. You can't so see. people come on, well, random so people. I don't know if the the competition has started yet. It has. It doesn't work on desktop. Oh no, it has. Yeah. Mm. It's up. So at yeah, the top, uh, there's like a number. Okay. But you can see all the presents he's got here. Like a don't. How much are these worth? Like. That's the stuff you can give. Oh, that's what I can give. Well, he not, has two thousand three hundred coins right now. I'll find out. That cannot be a lot of money. That's no, it's like ten bucks, I think. I think uh. it's less. Ten bucks. I think a point is a cent. It seems to be ten bucks according to this calculator here. Oh, okay. Mm. So he's in his um <laughs> with the fucking uh, the hat and shit. You know Tr Trisha's watching this with like all the pleasure in the world. <laughs> mm. the currency is so <laughs> weird. Six hundred and sixty <laughs> coins is ten dollars. Okay, so he's got 2,000? It says he's only been live for 18 minutes. So, in 18 minutes, he's made... 30 bucks? I've seen him get 5,000 coins the past 10 minutes. He's mm. gotten 5,000 more? No, I've been watching for 10 minutes. 5,000 on guard? That's, that's $25 you get home, because they take 70%. Is $25, mm. AB? It sounds like you said it was... $25 in 10 minutes? I think... I mean, that's, it's, but Love is saying they're taking that's good 70%. Money. But it's not like eight hours a day. It's not like a normal I thought salary. that's what he did. I don't think he's... You, know, you can't do this for... Eight, oh, God. See, I don't want you guys to say all that. Ethan's watching. I, I'm not trying to get into... I'm not of trying to course make him, that was going to happen. I know. I'm not trying to make him feel bad or anything $25 like that. every 10 minutes is $150 an hour. Okay, but that is good money if you're doing like full-time work. Also, he has a mortgage on a $1.2 million house. 
All right, let's get off. Five thousand yeah. dongar. We love Jason, and um, I no disres- I didn't want to. I don't want to disturb him in his in his workplace. <laughs> I'm just genuinely curious to see it. It's interesting that we got to see it live when we were talking about it. Okay, six hundred and sixty coins is ten bucks. Yeah, and then TikTok takes seventy percent. <laughs> That's crazy. Seventy yeah. percent. Okay, so why do it, people use this platform? Yeah. I don't know. Why I'm should you so... give seventy percent? <laughs> Wait, they keep seventy <laughs> percent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. What? <laughs> That's crazy. Also, they don't allow you to take out more than a hundred bucks a day. You know, they have like this super advanced what? system. Oh, so he's not making more than no, no. Bucks. So Wait, that's it, not true. I've taken out more than that. yeah. But you, ne- but for people who don't make, you need to take. It's super bizarre. I've looked into it. I have like uh, more than a thousand dollars on TikTok. Mm-hmm. I can't. Withdraw it. <laughs> Why? Because I don't make enough. So they got a thousand. You got to make more to withdraw more. Dude, what? TikTok is a fucking scam. It what the hell? Stop. That sounds I, like a scam. I, yes. I can't emphasize how much this web. This Jason, app. you're being used again. By <laughs> TikTok. Know, right? You had a better deal with David. <gasps> right. Wait, they take seventy percent. So you spend ten bucks, and then you have three dollars to give. To somebody? That's ridiculous. Well, well they you get give 10 three. bucks and yeah. TikTok keeps, yeah, well, yeah, yeah. pretty much. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> no way. Do you hear him? No. <laughs> is he He's, talking about me? He, I donated a whale and he started screaming my name. How much is a whale? I, it's so weird. That's what I was trying to figure out. It kept telling me exchange, exchange. And <laughs> like try and trick you so you don't Yeah, I don't know, know but he, he really liked it. <laughs> I have a um, psychotic. Wait, I have a bunch of coins on mine. Remember, Zach, when I was donating you a bunch? He gave me like a hundred bucks. It was awesome. Thank you again. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what, I don't know how I got them. I think I, oh, we, we used to go live, remember? No, you did the NPC thing. Oh, yeah. The N- yeah, we were yeah. live for okay, so much. Okay, so stream. people were donating. Okay. And like, so I converted it all into coins. <laughs> like, I'll go in there and I'll just do song requests and shit, which is like, you know, it's cool, like, you know, somewhat. Here, let me go. music, you know. Let me see how much coins I have and if I can go support Jason financially. Try to withdraw it. You're not going to be able to. No, I think I already invested it in coins. It's an investment. It's going to pay off for me. Yeah, I have 230. I'm, just, I'm still holding on to my FUPA coins. So I, I have $1,100 on TikTok and daily withdrawal limit is $100. <laughs> Dude, that's nuts. <laughs> that's funny. Wait, where do I see my money? Hey, hey. If you balance, the way, balance, yeah. The yeah, way he just balance. reacted makes me very afraid of how, about how much I just spent. <laughs> oh. You don't know how much you spent. It literally kept saying convert to coins, convert, and then it just didn't give me like a final, oh, I thought that's what I just spent. Love, you scared the fuck out of me. <laughs> Love just yeah. sent a screenshot of like, yeah, I thought that was what I just spent. Okay. $25 for a while. So I have- oh, 25 thank you. I have $1,833. <laughs> I'm gonna convert it. It's it's telling me to pay. I don't want to pay it out though. This says I can take it all out right now. This is minimum ten dollars. Yeah, a minimum ten dollars. Mine. Well, that's not maximum. That's minimum. Yeah, minimum. Well, maybe it's because you're verified or something. I don't know. You think so? Yeah, check on the. Okay, the yo, show. I can buy. I can buy one hundred and eighty-one thousand coins. Save 30% as no service fee applies. Are you sure they take 70%? That seems like unreal. They do. What? Well, I mean, maybe they changed it. I don't know. <laughs> but they All definitely right. did at some point. I mean, I feel like I gotta go, I gotta make it rain on Jason right now. Let's do it. Yeah. I got one hundred. Yeah. I have one hundred and eighty-one thousand coins. All right, I'm exchanging that shit. They didn't even go. Are you sure? They're like, thank you. I know. Yeah. It's so weird. <laughs> so wait, how much did you end up? Um, so Zach said it's like twenty-five dollars. Oh, so he's stoked on that. All right, so here's what I want. We're gonna open it now that I'm about to make it rain on him. Okay. So you got to do it quick because he's gonna play music. What? Like, cause it, when I did it, Journey was playing in the background. He just got in with a new person, so there's no music playing yet. Oh shit! Okay. Was it a good Journey song? 
Yeah. All right, Jason. I know David ain't paying you, so. Don't know how to act. Let me pay. Let me help you out for all the content you've given us. Weights or your workout program, or you know, I know you're into that. You know. This is about to get weird. My daughter was calling. I had to take it. I'm so sorry. All right, so how do I do this? I like your lemons. You're looking oh, thank real you. fresh. Yeah. Target. We got them at Target. Let me give him a crazy fresh, one. Real fresh tonight. The right, craziest one I can find yeah, is... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bye! All right, I'll see you in a sec. Hold on. This one's 25,000. Adam's dream. Like Yo, ah! look at that. Yeah. Gone, thank you! Big wireless Sierra! You guys can't thank see you, it. Sierra. Wait, oh what about... Oh, my God. Ethan Klein, 26,000. <laughs> Wow! <laughs> a universe from Ethan Klein. Wait, how much yes. is Oh wow! Ethan Klein, Eighth Street. Thank you, Ethan. Aww. That's very, very nice. Watch, I'm gonna send another one. He's gonna freak What's out. Oh wow! I'm sending Klein. another one. Watch. Fifteen dollars. <laughs> That's nice. I don't know if it's a troll or if it's uh. No. It comes in kindness. I'm not sure. Aww. Ethan again! <laughs> wow! Aww. Holy shit! Another one. I've let's send another one. Before. I have 180,000 points. Holy shit. A third one. Come on, let's go. Let's hey, go. Man, thank you for the another galaxy. One. Ethan, I've never seen that gift before. Yeah, because it's insane. Who the fuck oh, would spend? <laughs> I'm seeing the one I bought was $44. I was about to burn. Oh, oh my God. That fucking gift is sick. Yeah, it's so Wow. Sick. I think this has got to be the most expensive Three. one ever. You know, I don't even know what that what gift is called because I've never gotten it before. I'm going to send it Does again. Does anybody know what that gift is called? <laughs> That's four Holy times, shit. dude. We're going to space in this bitch. <laughs> it shows an astronaut riding universes. a rocket into space. <laughs> oh my God, Ethan! Jesus, bro. <laughs> I don't. You don't have to do that. <laughs> okay. Oh, that fucking that that is so sick. Sweet. How much coins do I have left? I just spent a lot of coins. A I have seventy-seven thousand. He's in a whale. competition with this girl, so yeah, she's just getting like, crushed right now. Oh, she's, yeah. oh, they're getting well, they're in competition. Uh, yeah. yeah. So yeah. What's, like, what's That's happening? What so what's the um? <laughs> she is getting <laughs> absolutely you just, dominated. You just dude. spirit bombed this girl, <laughs> girl out of the fucking competition. <laughs> oh wait, there's more expensive ones. Forty thousand. Wow. Forty-five. What the? F like there shouldn't even be options to go that far. Yeah. I'm not done, Jason. Uh oh. Talking about how nice this is. It is oh, nice. What it, what it was. I mean, I'm giving him 2,000 bucks, you know. Holes. That's a lot of money. More than 1,000 uh, bucks? Are you? Yeah. Oh my God. Well, I mean, bro, but, but TikTok has 70% of it. Oh, right. It's got copyright music assholes. playing. So, really? <laughs> You've given him 500 bucks yeah, after. <laughs> I had $1,800 from our live. Mm -hmm. We just did these goofs. Uh -huh. So I convert it into coins. Insane. And he's got to mute the music, man. Oh, can you guys tell him to mute the music? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking ACDC playing. Well, Wait, this so girl's almost eliminated, so I think a few more donations. Knockout punch. I'm trying to find a one to get. Which one should I give him? Fall candles? Ferris wheel? I want to take him on the Ferris wheel for some kisses. <laughs> I wish you guys could see it. <laughs> I have it, yeah, I have it on my phone. Yeah. Oh! Just went away. What's the score, AB? Oh, you see the red on top? Blurry. The red on top is, is his score compared to the blue. <laughs> Let's see. Maybe I'll wait for his next competition. This girl's crushed. <laughs> this girl's fucking O K O. Look Loser. how look how like dominated she is. She's like, damn. <laughs> so there wait, what's go. the score? I still Okay, can't. see the red on top? Compared to the blue, the red is him. Okay. Mm. Oh, so, I see. So she loses. Oh yeah, when she's, he gets she's, to, she's, yeah. How much does she have? Twenty. <laughs> this may be the worst loss in TikTok battle history. <laughs> Here, I'm gonna send. Ugh, what should I send? Why is there no like dicks or something fun? <laughs> <laughs> it's all boring shit. I cut my nails last night. But for real though, there there are options here. How about I am holding shoes? you proud of me? Yeah. Sure. I'm. I have my arm stabilized. Yeah, I dance it. Dan said he's so proud of how stable my hand is. Dr. Steady Hands. Yo, so the most expensive one on here that I can see is, uh, here, these ones are crazy. Oh, he muted it. Oh, so I'm on H3 now? Is that is that yes. what I'm being told? Can somebody type that here? I guess I'll look. So I'm going to drop a gold mine. <laughs> H3. Am I being made fun of on H3? No. Right now? no. So we're hooking you Oh, up. yeah, I'm the thumbnail. Oh, boy. 
<laughs> oh boy. <laughs> well, hello H Tree. How are you? Thank you, Ethan. I'm just sending I'm making it rain. For him. Poor Vanna has no Jason, idea what's going on. She, she doesn't and love. understand. And love. Dude, I'm making um, it rain right now. Only Another peace thank and you, love. Ethan, for the I guess thank you. She doesn't understand. <laughs> it's going crazy. <laughs> she doesn't understand our history. Poor Vanna. Yeah, well. I'm no, sorry. David is rushing okay, to his okay, house okay. 200 miles an hour right now. Okay, okay. Get off okay. the fucking phone. Let's Jason, let's thank everybody. Dinosaur. Ethan gets the booster. Ethan, you got a boosting glove. So I don't if know you want to stick around, wait, what is boosting glove? Time is five. If you want to stick for the next game. And then Ethan, that's amazing. Wait, what does it mean? Man, what does it mean that you did it? Skull. All right, let's knock her out. Let's knock her out. Bebop, Weed, and Evan. Let's get some fireworks going. Thank you, guys. Man, I'm so I'm so sorry. It's uh, I think I think. No, 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 no! I'm not. I, I'm not mad. I don't. I won't ever get mad. I'm just confused. Everyone's <laughs> telling me I'm on the podcast. I have anxiety. Yeah, I'm on the podcast right now, so we're, we're I'm sending the them nonstop. Podcast. I don't know. Okay, if you here, can see. here now. Ian, they should show um, up now. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Again, These are all me. I'm sending. I don't know if it'll be good for you. I'm sending you a right. car. You sure? Do you see so that? Is, there it is. is. <laughs> is I'm sending I fireworks. Really, really big podcast. A, a podcast that's like it's just like nonstop. A episodes, so it's <laughs> more fireworks. <laughs> I'm sending a dinosaur. <laughs> I know. I know. I know. <laughs> oh man, sending, dinosaur. Uh, oh, my views went up. I love the dinosaur. I'm sending um, <laughs> a good <laughs> afternoon. Oh, guys, we're daily 80, and we're, oh my god, we just broke the top 80 because of Ethan Klein. No, oh my sending, god. Uh, All right, Ethan, I don't know if you know how to play. We don't know what that <laughs> means, but we're happy for you, buddy. <laughs> happy Friday. I mean, what, what's a happy Friday sticker? There you go. Yeah, I wish I recorded when you said my name. See. You did it perfectly. Here's a we whale, Dr. Well a whale. might as well see if we can get into ranks. Love a whale. Ethan Thank you, Ethan, for the happy like Friday. Friday. There's the whale. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear we you. Can hear her. You want something? I don't know. Sorry, yeah. this Even is all for you. This is the I'm Jason so fund. I'm sorry. Well, I scare the love. No, here we go. sorry. This is the <laughs> Jason <laughs> fund. He needs it. Yeah. He, <laughs> girl, he deserved it. Oh, meteor you shower. This one looks nice. Hundred, which is really nice of you. Thank <laughs> meteor you so shower. Much. Um, oh, forty thousand people looking at me. No big deal. Yeah. Do you see the fireworks? Where are they? And I guess Ben Shapiro dropped a rap No fireworks. All right, I'm sending a jellyfish. Um, That's we true. Go. We're going to watch oh, that next. Jellyfish. Um, oh, Jason, yeah, you want to? go. Well, thanks for the plug, bro. Watermelons. Thank you, Ethan. Thank you for the aquarium or whatever that one's called. <laughs> I'm sending um, a, how are you, uh, a championship <laughs> trophy. Crazy, what are you talking about? I'm fine. Don't. I'm not yeah. good under pressure. Um, God, Trust I have so me, many this coins. Is quite, quite an I can't tell you this enough. Like, I sent does like. not happen for me ever. I sent like 120,000 so, when I started. Let me see. <laughs> let me see if I can see him. Think, I, I don't want to burn through actually, him, although. Oh my God. I think he's got a troll account it's, over here. Travel. It's not a troll. Well, no, it's, it's real money, girl. Yeah, that, it's not you, a troll. You, you could spend it's not that a troll money. Account. I mean, he might be trolling or he might be. He's got 1.8 no. million. That's him. Here we go. He came with a troll with me. It's a different account. What? Girl, what are you stop. talking about? It's dude. real money. Yeah. Troll. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. She's coping. We're, we're She's sorry, saying. girl. I'm sending an epic GG yeah. to oh, flex fantastic. on her. I look hey, those are my hands. Really. Yeah, 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 yeah. I just sent an epic <laughs> GG to <laughs> flex. Thank you, Ethan. Uh, 2300. Ethan with the good game, or I used to call it gang gang. <laughs> oh. Oh. Sending flowers. Oh, Wait, how do I put stuff on him? How do I do that? It's certain ones, like the cowboy hat. I think they're the cheaper ones. Let's oh, they're go. cheaper ones? Thank Dude, so this is crazy. I spent like like $500 and it's like a gift for like two seconds. I should dominate the screen. <laughs> Mr. Orange? What is this? Is it going to turn him to orange? Um... Oh my god, there is so many. Oh. Thank you so much for the followers. Sunglasses? Oh my god, that's embarrassing. We Guys, need a good we one need after that. We sunglasses? <laughs> yeah, sunglasses. Hi, there you go. It's not going on. Uh, there it is. Cowboy hat. But I didn't do the cowboy Savannah, hat. Says jaunty. Oh, no, that's no, the sunglasses? No, oh, there it is. There it is. Uh, so, uh, how about a crown? How about I just keep the crown on his head? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to send like 10. I'm going to send a bunch of crowns. Casey followed. Thank you. Ness followed. I'm sending so many crowns. Oh, is this exciting? This is fun, right? Keep, <laughs> yes, keep like Mr. Beast. Uh, Alright, I just sent like 20 <laughs> crowns. Um, Thank you, Lisa with the galaxy. Let's go. Let's send some autumn leaves. 
Yeah. Yeah, it's true. I think Jason's just no, like tripping true. out. Like. Yeah. Um, I'll take this moment if I'm on H Street. Go for He just my paid his mortgage, bro. What'd he say? What did he say? What did he say? Oh, his son's <laughs> band. Is that what he said? Cow. Wait, what did he say? Thank you. What did he plug? Say it again. Cow. It's my son's okay, band. His son's. Oh, oh great. But I think this Thank you, Ethan, for the crown. You're welcome for the crown, um, King. You dropped I will this, take King. This opportunity mm -hmm. to uh, show Ethan's audience. The goal is on Yeah, show me. Actually, no, I want to see. No, 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 Mo. Guys, it's okay. I don't care about losing. You heard. Listen, Wait, why are people so worried about her? Battles are all about supporting creators. It's totally. Yes. I mean, like. Okay, girl. Don't take it personally. Lisa. Thank you, Lisa. Thank you, Nightmare. Uh, hang, hang in there. <laughs> hang in there, bro. Nightmare. Oh, nightmare. <laughs> this Galaxy one's Hello. sick. I'm gonna send a Galaxy. <laughs> Just Those so are you the future ones. Nightmare Klein. Thank you, Mo. I appreciate um, you guys. Yes. The I Lion will. one is really cool too. Um, oh my God. God, they need better Thank options. You, for the Galaxy. You're welcome, bro. <laughs> Here she comes. Rabbit. I just sent a rabbit. I sent a podium. Thank you, sent a ice skate. Oh, these are the gift I've never seen. Thank you. He's, he's, seen, he's, he's never seen these ones. Did he show us the sun's Oh, band? shit. I sent him the podium. That one was 20,000. <laughs> is it over? <laughs> no, she's still fighting. This is this is kind of amazing. Sort of like a modern day Rocky. I can't see the score. I want to see the score. Good game. Justin, MVP. Justin. Let's do the. Baby but Dragon? Guys, thank you, Lisa, Rowan, yeah, Baby Lisa, Dragon. Jessica, Gary, Happy Girl, um, Michael, Richard, Paul, good, uh, Richard oh. wants to drop his glove. Yeah, we gotta see, it's you guys gotta see the cool action. Here, this one's Lemonade. Right, so really I bet he's never seen this one. Go check it out. <laughs> Ethan, thank you for the tiny diny. <laughs> You're welcome, my brother. <laughs> I got you tiny diny <laughs> all day. <laughs> check out the Lemonade here. fan. Lemonade? That's right. How about Fall Candles? You ever seen this one? No. Look at this now, shit. We are 62nd in the country. When we started this match, I wasn't even in the top 100. Well, <laughs> so that's really that. good. Ethan with the fall candle. Yep. <laughs> Here comes the blowfish. That one was big in October. But now it's. Uh, oh my God. It's actually what you say? Going that's the true. It is out winter. Of style. Going through the. Uh, I don't even know what that one is. How about the rhythmic um, bear? Love donkey. Thank you. Carol, thank you. John, thank you so much. No I appreciate it. Oh, yeah. This one's good. You guys will like this one. Rhythmic All right, bear. Dana. Good games, Jason. Good game. Oh, there's the dancing bear from Ethan. Yeah. Let's see how many points. Ethan uh, has accumulated let's see. 168,000 points. Nice. Oh, my God. Have a great All right, hold on. Let me just bust Bye, my load, Thanks. and then we, we'll, we can go. Let me look. I have 12. Oh, it's over? Wait, he left? Bro, I'm not done giving River. you shit. No, okay, he's he doing next. One. She was done. Okay, next. River. Jason, I'm currently getting a cover up tattoo right now, and I thought. All right, let's get what? this party started. I want to Jason Nash right Ruin now. Let's script. go, baby. <laughs> You're exactly gonna love it. Jason so thinks I'm up. never running remember out of money. Remember yesterday when you went to top 41 in 40 minutes? <laughs> I do. I do remember that. I'm glad you remember it too. I remember. Why are people oh, giving them? This is never. River from Calabasas. River, you're catching us at an interesting time. All right. <laughs> Wait, it, keep showing the phone. The screen. I want to see again. I'm back. The hell? With the gang gang. I'm chasing you, dude. Get, take oh, my money. Ethan Klein? What the? Chuck, can we I beat know. Ethan Klein? I know. Get out of here. You can't beat Ethan. The other day, Dar Man was here. I have 6,000 left. Ethan Let's Klein go. with the astronaut on yep. treadmill. Here's How is a... Ethan Klein sniping against me? I don't know. No, man. it's it's What's not about. It's not about also, you. <laughs> they take it so uh, oh, I'm on A podcast. The girl, right. They're like, I'm so sorry. Let's go, Let's go right now. <laughs> Let's fucking go right now. Yes. Send him the car. I love his excitement. It makes me feel good when I send it. Oh my god. Maybe you're starting to see the appeal of this. You're talking like, shit, but, uh, or something. Let's bust out something, something here. Here's a hand card. for us. Here's a rope. Jason's hype right now. If anybody does this well, it is Jason Nash. I just sent a rope. Holy Wait, shit. Is there a way to send like multiple? This is bad. Oh, this guy's getting fucking. Actually, it's fun watching the other person get destroyed. <laughs> yeah. That's actually rewarding. Hand hearts. Ethan Klein. Confetti. I'm going to have to put another 10,000 of my own money in here. He's not like that. I'm not kidding. Oh, he might. He might. He's never dropped a line in his life. That's why he's 25. No, he dropped like. 
four universes already. <laughs> four <laughs> universes, bro. That's how they gauge money <laughs> on TikTok. Four four we gotta try something. Bro, I dropped. Oh, Rosalie, all right, you ready? I'm shot. about to drop mystery <laughs> firework, two thousand, and then I'm pretty bro, much out. What the hell is this, bro? He's gonna bro. lose his mind. Look at this. <laughs> Music's coming back. <laughs> Ethan with the fireworks, be kind to yourself. Oh, that's a good message. I did not send that one. Tristan Bay is here. Um, foodies, no cap. Good afternoon. I'm almost out of money, guys. I'm sorry, I haven't been thanking everybody. We can snipe this shot. We can snipe this. Do we have a glove? Does anyone have a glove? Bro, you're done. Don't even try. Nicole? All right. Let's see. Here's uh, travel with you. Um, a thousand. Guys, thank you for being here today. I really appreciate it. Yeah. It's always fun on TikTok. Uh, and on then let me just do one more. One thousand people. The flip. I see yeah. you. Ethan, I can climb with the travel with me. <laughs> this guy's a gem. Weatherman. Forty-one thousand people watching. You can cook this. And then here I can send but nine can roses. That. We can figure this out. Oh, I can Ethan click with the laser at the send. Center. Okay. Thank you, okay. Ethan. Well, if he doesn't drop a uni, I'm gonna be disappointed. <laughs> He, uh, he already dropped right, four. I am I now spent $1,800. He might be done with the bid. <laughs> <laughs> 2000 in the live, guys. Incredible. Uh, don't and that's like Friday, this. baby. Thank you so much. That's how we do it around here. Right, and don't forget to follow me up here at Fall River, too. I don't remember what he said, but check out his son's band. That's yeah. cool. That's good dad. That's good dadding. All right, well. All God, right. I wish I had more money. It was so fun. I want to <laughs> yeah, keep... Yeah, that was great. It was so fun. I love throwing money to <laughs> to uh, panhandlers. <laughs> See, that's not nice. Mm. No, that's me. I mean, it is virtual panhandling, though, right? I think literally, right? It yeah. is literally, yeah. It's literally, <laughs> yeah. you know, like when we were pull it, when we were driving to work, there was a dude who was panhandling in the road with a mm. sign, right? I would have, if he had a TikTok account, I would have given him some roses and stuff. <laughs> you should get on TikTok. But I did, you know what I mean? You missed out. Yeah. Next time I'll ask, do you have TikTok? <laughs> I'll send you some roses, brother. Oh, man. That was fun. That was a rush. <laughs> that was so fun. We love you, Jason. Oh, this is the thumbnail he saw of himself. That's confusing. I can see why. What is that? Yeah, I don't. What is it? Just because of the tongue thing, Cam? <laughs> oh, he smiles with the tongue. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Exactly. All right. Good luck out there, Jason. Have a great Friday, buddy. <laughs> if Dave is not paying you, I sure as hell will. <laughs> He's probably richer than me, too, I, I would assume. Jack kept saying you had some kind of glove. I kept saying use the glove. I have a glove? Wait, what does that mean? I got I a glove? I don't know what it means. <laughs> like a finishing move, maybe? I don't know. You know what I mean? <laughs> I did spend a lot of fucking money. Send? I can send it. Wait. You know what I mean? <laughs> no, it's asking me to recharge. Hmm. What's a glove, you guys? I'm gonna send a glove. <laughs> it's not a gift. We could save it for another. So, but, no, I want it. No, Jason, I want the glove. <laughs> I'm a gifter level 25, you guys. I think that's the top level, maybe. Oh, man. Well, if you find out what's the glove, let <laughs> yeah, me know. Yeah, I'll look into it. And I'll come back for you, J JJ. <laughs> We're dogs now. Oh, here it is. Boosting glove. What does that do? I'm Boosted! Grants up to 30% chance of triggering times five points. No! Oh, that fuck. would have been crazy if I used that. Uh, Damn. I have three of them. Save it. Oh, shit. Save it till tomorrow. Or It'll be live Friday. on Monday. <laughs> we'll have to do a live so we can accumulate a bunch of coins again. <laughs> sure. They send it to me so I can send it to him. Mm -hmm. Essentially. Oh, man, the booster. 30% chance to trigger times five. Dude, he's about That's to retire. Crazy. Ugh. It sucks. <laughs> Breaks my heart. Um, well, that was exciting. Good shit. He's gonna get his, he's gonna be able to pay his mortgage this month. Yeah. Which is a relief. A big relief. <clears throat> All right, where were we? 
So that's what he does. We were going to show David, right? So here he is. Um, David recently went to check on him as he heard about his reputation for, you know, doing these TikTok lives and mm. people were talking. So David Dobrik being the good friend, the good caretaker that he is, uh, he went to visit him. So here's this. I like to visit him at least once a week just to make sure that he's alive. I know that he's doing TikTok live every day now, but I'm still not convinced it's him. It could be AI at this point. <laughs> Jason! <gasps> oh my god, I thought you were Wyatt. I got so freaked out. You haven't seen him in a while? Yeah. Live streaming. I was, and then it wasn't going well, so I got off. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, you're kind of becoming a legend on TikTok now. I know. Not, not in a good way. <laughs> yeah, but I, I think it's fun. Not in a good this way. motherfucker showed up in a goddamn crown. Mm -hmm. To laugh at him mm -hmm. being a TikTok quote legend. I mean, listen, I can make fun of the guy. I'm not responsible for him. This is tasteless. Yeah. This is just mean. Dude, David Dobrik sucks. He is such a douche. People still watch him. That's nuts to me. I, I've seen TikToks with like take a shot every time Jason Nash is on live. You haven't come over in like a little bit. And I called Joe and I was like, is Jason doing okay? And Joe's like, I haven't seen him on live in a while. And I go, how long has it been? And he's like, hours. And that's, just, that's, that's when we start to worry when you haven't been on live. Yeah, because yeah, like he needs to work, bro. Why is that funny? Like, it's, mm. come on, it's not funny. Let's get a Jason fun going. We need to get a, f we need to get a, a f count. I know, but I'm not responsible for him. I don't go to his house in a crown. And like, what did David Dobrik, he drives like a Aston Martin or some shit. Mm -hmm. Shows up mm -hmm. in his Aston Martin and the crown jewels to go fucking tap dance on his best friend's dead career. You just got back from like a Christmas dinner. Why are you dressing so nice? Well, you do better on TikTok Live when you look nice. Is that true? Yeah. Where did you get that stat that you do better on TikTok Live? Is that just from testing? No, someone told me that. Wait, really? I met this live streamer. He's a really nice guy. He was like, hey, little tip. It's like, when you dress nice, you'll, you'll do better. And I Bro, was like, I can't tell you that. This really makes me sad. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He goes, I need to dress nice. I get more donations. Mm -hmm. Like he's a fucking door-to-door -door Mormon or some shit. Like, damn, bro, come on. You don't have to wear that turtleneck. You don't. You shouldn't have to wear that turtleneck. Not if you don't want to. It, he's being forced to wear a turtleneck. Now, that's not right. Yeah, but if he wants up. to, it looks good. Yeah. He, did, he, don't, he does it because he wants donations. Right. And right. A, and a Which TikToker. is where the problem lies. You're right. You're right. Also, yeah. At, uh, yeah. Of course. Uh, uh, nah, I don't. Whatever. It makes like, me. And then I tried it out. But and then again, I didn't make any money today, so. <laughs> Bye, guys. Thanks for having us over in your, Bye guys. In your little hobbit home. <laughs> Dude can't even afford a whole door, man. <laughs> <laughs> like, David, how are you just going to wave goodbye like that? Come on. <laughs> Poor guy. Now, oh, me moved to the Shire, dude. I'm a bit curious because he was sitting in a pretty nice car there too. Like I couldn't a, tell what kind of car it was. It was a Lucid Air, I think. One of those new Lucid. No, he's yeah. driving a Lucid. Yeah. I because th that's think... like a hundred thousand plus car. I think yeah. it's even more than that. I think I recognize Wait, how can the you steering tell? wheel. Okay, let me see again. In the if center. he's driving a Lucid, then then like what the I fuck? I want my money back. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I thought he'd be in like a Camry, like 985 yeah. Camry. <laughs> <laughs> when we start to worry when you haven't been on yeah, yeah. You look like you just got back from like a Christmas dinner. See if Why are you dressing lucid. so nice? Why well, you do better? Right? Uh, that's yeah. definitely a lucid. There's that it, no way he drives that. He let him try out his car. He got <laughs> it lucid. That's that's there's no way Jason can afford that. How much is that car? I don't know. He are has they that expensive? They're they're really, I don't know. Yeah, they're super expensive. They they're like I mean, super high end. There's different models, I, I believe. Well, what's I started at 75k. Mm. Oh, but the start, yeah, yeah. That don't, is David's car. <laughs> you, yeah, okay. <laughs> so it's even big. more of a dick. <laughs> he came David's over car? and he says, "Come sit in my hundred thousand dollar car." Mm. <laughs> or so it could it could be a gifted one as well. I mean, gifted. Yeah, he gives he gives to all of his friends' cars. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, t- something tells me based on their interaction and the way, you know. <laughs> but, um, yeah, you I don't like think you just he got back from like a Christmas dinner. Why are you dressing so nice? Well, you do better on TikTok Live when you look nice. Is that true? Yeah. He fucking made him come out and look at his car and get in the driver's seat. It's like the humiliate. He needs to humiliate him. We don't further. know exactly yet what is this situation. Mm-hmm. So I'm just saying. So, I I found a video of David using a lucid with That's, the same color scheme. There it is. So, I think that has good to catch be. though, love. Yeah. It's funny. Oh my god. Yeah, you have a Rolex you want to show him or something? <laughs> Try you it know? on. Let's see. Try it on a little bit. Yeah, you want to see how you look in this Rolex, bro? <laughs> Oh, fuck me. Oh, shit. Where did you get that stat that he'd do better on TikTok Live? Is that just from testing? No, someone told me that. Wait, really? Oh, man. Ugh. There's another one. Is this the same one? A fan page uploaded this in December. Is that the same one? Yeah, it's the same one. Just showing the origin where it came from. Guys, I'm visiting Jason. I'm curious I like about... I to visit him at least once a week. So this is a, to make sure that he's a Snapchat re-upload? That'd be my guess. I couldn't find a lot of information on it. Someone put it on our subreddit, and I found that it was linked to this. Dude, people love him. Like, even this re-upload gets mega views. Top comment. So these these are comments from December, so this is before... This isn't even coming from me. Jason is straight up laughing through the pain as David laughs in his face. Mm. This is sad, and I feel like Jason's just trying to laugh through the pain. Mm -hmm. This is equivalent of a former boss showing up to your new employment after firing you and roasting you for not getting paid enough. They don't even know that it probably that that's David's car. You know? This beautiful new. This is actually so sad. I get okay, so uh, everybody sees it. Mm-hmm. If Dave was a real friend, he would help bro out because he stopped doing the podcast, knowing the money he would get and how it maintains Jason's life. Oh, yeah, I heard Jason saying they had this big podcast together. I heard heard you guys talk about it. And Jason was like, I miss the money. Yeah. You know, you you got to. Like you had this big thing that was really important to him. You got to keep it flowing, bro. Find a way. It's gross. He sucks. It is gross. How old is David Dobrik now? Um. 27. 27. Old ass. Loser. David sitting on multi-millionaires laughing at his friends. Ouch. David's laughing at him for being on live, but David's job is literally posting to his Snapchat story. True. The only difference is you make money doing, a lot more money doing it. Mm-hmm. David is laughing, but he low-key did that to Jason. <laughs> David, can you like help Jason out? Like, damn. The guy that obviously needs money. Comments. Yeah. Wow. Was Jason pretending he had to drive somewhere so David would leave? <laughs> Jason and all his friends helped him become a millionaire. Now David leaves them for broke. Okay, yeah. Everybody sees what we see. Yeah. Um, we got a little bit of a donation here. Checking the We got a little the Discord. Oh. <laughs> Wait, what? Wait. You're <laughs> someone's giving me my money back. This is from t- <laughs> TikTok. What? <laughs> it's from TikTok. 500 euros. Your money back. Peace and love. Your money laundering agent. What? <laughs> it's uh, our friend, our Saudi benefactor. Oh my yeah. God, dude. Money. That's Shout out. funny. No money. Numbers go up. No so money. that actually might be accurate. That might be how much. Is that a real money donation? Yeah, it's no a real money. donation. What? Yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> Fucking guy. Oh my That's God. crazy. <laughs> oh, shit. Whoa. Money. Money. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. That's funny, too. It's very funny. <laughs> Thanks for the money laundering. Appreciate that. But that actually might be how much Jason actually got from me. 500 from 1800 Right. Mm-hmm. So I, I did get a refund. Thank you to TikTok. But I see two of them. Why is that? It's a bug. This is a bug? Oh, yeah. Okay. You Sometimes sure? It double shows it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, because it's like exactly the same. Well, there you go. We love Jason Nash, folks. I mean, well, we're limited. We limit that. We put an asterisk next to that statement. Yeah. We put an asterisk and a footnote next to that. 
TikTok just donated 50 uh, memberships as well. Oh my god, thank you, man. The thank official you, TikTok, TikTok account. You know, I've been saying a lot of mean things about TikTok, but I feel like, you know, I'm real it's really turning around for you guys. I'm understanding. I'm Well, you're just it. having a blast on there. Oh, 100 from TikTok. Yo, I'm about oh to god. I'm about to have a live competition right now. <laughs> Jason, get in here. Let's compete. <laughs> TikTok Somebody said Ethan's hair looks like Austin McBroom. So that's what I'm saying. Oh. Kind of. It's a broccoli assassin. You know? It mm, it doesn't. Golly. Golly. <laughs> Come on. <sighs> Thank you, TikTok. Appreciate that. All right. So the other one we need to talk about is the um the Ben Shapiro. This yeah. will be our last or well, probably our last story. But um, I've been really looking forward to this. <laughs> and I've held off. The, the color of your of your booty hole. So, <laughs> thank you. So, Ben Shapiro put out. He put out. I'm trying to find out where the fuck. Hey. What number is it? Number one in goops and gaps. Oh, here it is. He collaborated with this dude, Tom McDonald, who I guess is. He's one of those MAGA rappers. We've talked about him before. So he <laughs> he has a lot of followers on YouTube. Dude has he's like probably the most popular million. of these like kind of MAGA. He's definitely doing better than uh, the dude with the Minecraft beard, right? That almost accidentally blew up a plane. Well, oh, there's that other guy. He's uh, he's uh, he's heavier and uh, yeah. He was in Target. Fakasha Joe. Yeah. Fakasha bread. <laughs> Fakasha bread Joe. Yeah. Shores of California, all the way down to the Keys. Only he will bring us closer <laughs> when we fall to our knees. And he'll lift us from the ground so that everyone can see. Oh, oh no. Big Nick. Ever. No. So I'm looking at his, his music videos. He had one from two years ago, 38 million views. Oh. Called Fake Woke. Hell yeah. You know what? I'm going to give them, pay them a... Uh, their dues before I get into this and credit them for saying they did not claim the video. Mm. Which is so shocking. I got mad respect for that. Thank you. Thank you for letting us mock it. Like, really? I mean, yeah. that's what it's all about. Genuinely. I got mad respect for that. The same thing with um, a lot of the other MAGA rappers never fucked with us when we made fun of them. The, uh, the one I just played, uh, I had to remove the background music. Yeah, that one was getting close. Oh, that one. I remember, yeah. <clears throat> Fakasha Joe. Mm -hmm. What was? I don't know if that was uh, Fakasha Joe. That, that was, was um, that was Minecraft beard guy. That was Mike. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. That was like the right wing. Like <coughs> we are the world. You're right. Exactly. Yeah. They We're, do they do collab a lot. Fakasha Joe and Minecraft beard. But uh, I think that one was a uh, Minecraft beard led project. So this guy, um, Tom <laughs> McDonald. Yeah. He seems to only do uh maga raps sheeple these are his top ones sheeple american flags superman fake woke dirty money and his new one that just dropped seven hours ago with ben shapiro <laughs> facts now yep. i'll be totally honest with you guys when i saw this i was browsing um twitter <laughs> and i saw this and i didn't spend a long time looking at it because I, I was like, oh, this is just a weird deep fake. Like, I don't get it. <laughs> and I promise you, I did not. I, I just mean, it's, left. It, it, there may be some deep faking going on in parts of this video, I guess. But as far as I can tell, this is this is co-signed by Benny Boy. <laughs> and this is like, uh, wait, you don't think it's him? Uh, I mean, I did initially, and then you said that, and then I was no, like, not I, because I guess it no, could be. It was just my, I was in just disbelief that this would never happen. Right. That was exactly, I thought it was a deep fake. Yeah, Olivia was also saying that. Um, but yeah, he's tweeting it and stuff, so even it, regardless, it's, yeah. it's co-signed by Ben Shapiro. It's, I think it is Ben. Yeah, no, I think, I think so too. It's the MAGA white and nerdy. That's all I can say. I'm white and nerdy. <laughs> Every once I'm white and nerdy. I'm white awesome. and nerdy. Those hoodies are just... Wait. Facts. Does I don't his, care about your feelings. Does his tattoo say hog? Uh, it's real blurry, so it's hard to tell, but it Can does you? look like hog. <laughs> this dude, it says hog on his He's face. He's a hog, all right. Oh. Hold on. You, we got we to gotta see if that's what it is. So, yeah, I'll find a close-up of him. Ben Shapiro, let's see what he had to say about it. This is the real deal, my friends. Does, in fact, say hog. 
This yeah. man tat uh -huh. this man tattooed hog on his face. He did. Here Shabbat Shalom it. from my hip hop household. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Thoughts? Oh my god. Huh? It's like West Borland if he left like this. Dog, he's... Olivia, what do we think? Uh, Hot as SpongeBob? Uh, By the way, you're catching heat for that comment, <laughs> Olivia. You said SpongeBob's kind of hot. That's not you, what I said. You. That is simply not indeed. what I said. What did you say? No, I said before all this happened, well, before well I found out what a terrible guy he was when he was on the top of the Broadway world, mm -hmm. I was like, wow, who's this guy who's got a Tony nomination? Yeah. That's all I said. I don't you didn't say any of that. Mm, no. <laughs> I said you all of that. Say an entirely different word. Yeah, yeah. Indeed. An but no, he's, right. but I'm with you. He's a strange looking, sometimes strange looking dudes, if they got, like, that's yeah. hot sometimes. Yeah. Because yeah. it's like a blank slate in a way where it's like, if you like who he is and what he's about, you'll find him hot. Mm -hmm. He's just strange looking. Yeah. You your mind doesn't know what to make of it. And he's a mm -hmm. talented guy. He's probably yeah. charismatic. Yeah. You know? Wicked Very. tapper. Well said. Well said. <laughs> oh yeah, nothing hotter than a man who tap dances. The tap solo. Yeah. Well said. Ugh. Yep. Um. So anyway, without further ado, let's hear it. Facts. Ben comes in about halfway through. By the way, if you start to be like, I'm tired of hearing. About <laughs> no, this whole thing's good. They can't cancel my message because I'm the biggest independent rapper in the whole freaking world. That's <laughs> not true by any metric. <laughs> <laughs> Within two seconds, there's only two genders. We're we're right to the point. Here. He's the biggest independent rapper in the world. I mean, why? I mean, that's just wait, provably so, false. Wait, he already said there's two genders. Mm -hmm. That was like the second line out of his mouth. Oh, I missed it. Yeah, and then goes into there's only two the genders. Best rapper. Yeah, here. What? They call me offensive, controversial. There's only two genders, boys and girls. They can't cancel my There's only two genders, boys and girls. Why boys and girls look creep? I don't yeah, think of men and women. women. I think of adults. Yeah, you think of children. I don't children. know what you think about their boys and, that's and facts, girls. That's facts, dude, Tom. Spooky. Actually, uh, E-40 is the uh, independent uh, rapper of all time. E-40, this guy ripped off E-40's um, music video. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. <laughs> I'll show you. Let me show you. Yeah. E-40 choices. You can't, you can't show. I'm not going to play it. I'm just going to show you the set. Okay. We'll, we'll mute it, right? Yeah. I love the, you, I love this song. It's one of the best, my favorite songs, and the video is insane too. He's got all these hip hop legends co-signing him, and there's tons yeah. of um, TVs and shit behind yeah. him. Hold Big on. Sean. Yeah. Here, here. Wait. Oh, God damn it. Uh, God damn it. Here. There. Kind of. Mm. I'll get a good shot so you can see that he ripped him off. He needs a clip of you co-signing him in his next video. Huh? Uh, here. Yeah. Nope. Yeah. Yeah. So he's in this kind of yeah. room with all these TVs and shit. Yeah. Definitely rip. Yep. Yeah. All right. Let's get. Let's go. Facts. Rapper in the whole freaking world. The whole freaking the whole world. Freaking world. The, the whole flipping world. <laughs> the whole gosh down world. <laughs> If every Caucasian's a bigot, I guess every Muslim's a terrorist. Every liberal is right. I don't want to talk to folks who don't get it. Go, whoa, go, broke, don't hope. Oh. I feel like of all the things to rap about, oh this is God. the lamest shit. Facts, this this dude. dude is no, straight rapping kidding. about, um, he says, if all whites are racist, all Muslims are terrorists. Okay. Every liberal is right. Every. That's the next line. If every Caucasian's a bigot, I guess every Muslim's a terrorist, every liberal is right. You have lyrics? Yeah. I'm, mm -hmm. <laughs> it, it's linked in the doc, too. Oh, I want to pull those up. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I was hoping it had uh, closed captions, but it's not there yet. He's up on genius, dude. Yeah. He's a genius. <laughs> That's Tom. awesome. All right, go ahead. It's pathetic pro choice pronouns, pro love, you're progressive, but you ain't pro gun, no one to protect it. Where the American flags at? Remember when people would hang those? They've been taken down, they've all been replaced with BLM flags or a rainbow. Where? Bro, no. what world do you live in? People like, hang American flags still. It's only BML and rainbow flags now, <laughs> in every neighborhood across America. <laughs> I see. Where, what are you talking about? We live Indeed. in liberal Los Angeles, and I see American flags <laughs> all of the time. All of the time. I don't believe I've ever seen a BLM flag from a residential house. A either. BLM flag? Yeah. Like, maybe I've yeah. seen a rainbow maybe like twice in my life. Mm -hmm. Oh, I see like pride flags a decent amount, but a, like, is there even like a, what is that even a BLM flag? 
Yeah, I don't know if they have a flag. I don't think they. I don't think they fuck with flags like that. They don't believe in flags. <laughs> Indeed, they don't Indeed. believe in flags. Are flags yeah. are uh, ugly things, you know? Well, flags are frankly for co- colonists. That's right. I mean, that's, that's it's nationalism, baby. That's the tool of the colonizer. Burn them all the flags. So, true leftists don't believe in flags. Oh, what? Somebody said he's obsessed with USA stuff, but he's Canadian. He is. Yeah, I just fact checked. Yo, what? Oh, no what? way. Poser. <laughs> All no these grifters, dude. Same with with, Cana- with Canadians, they're either the coolest or the lamest. Yeah. Tom McDonald. So There's nothing in between. Canadian. Crowder's Canadian. It's like Crowder, yeah, exactly. We ain't selling drugs. We ain't gonna overdose. We ain't pushing We're not cool. <laughs> I gotta say, he's a douchebag, but I dig the fuck out of his shades, man. Those Vuittons. His shades? Yeah. They're in oh. the shades, huh? Yeah. Okay. They got like Vuitton, the print on the lenses. Vuitton? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Louis Vuitton? Yeah. But Vuitton. Vuitton? <laughs> Vuitton. Is that Vuitton. two people ever call them that? Vuitton. Vuitton. I've never heard that before. Vuittons? Thugs or your daughters in the holes. I don't care if I offend you. No, he said it. I was pretty to a set. Here comes Ben, like, not, like eight miles. Whatever. Ben could yeah. move to save his Ma- life. Mom's spaghetti, like, dude. <laughs> this is like high school level of R- Ryan. Yeah, mm-hmm. talent show. Yeah, Ben's is really Ben's. When we'll get there, but it get, it really reminded me of Jake Paul's. Um, every day, every day, every day, bro. Yeah, like the the delivery, <laughs> the, yeah. the rhythm. <laughs> you see how he awkwardly like, waves? He waves. He's like, hi. Hi, it's me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so confused by this guy's persona because, like, he obviously, the way that he carries himself and expresses himself to the world, he's very much a part of, like, what he thinks is the hip hop community aesthetically. Mm-hmm. Like he's gone all out. Got the, the grill, grill he's doing the dreadlock. Yeah, yeah. You know, he's trying to do something, but he also he wants to be on like the Jesus side. Yeah, I don't do drugs. He's rapping about it. he doesn't do drugs. Ain't no, no way premarital this sex. Do For real? Wasn't he, there a line about that? Why do you look uh, like that? He said something about we won't turn your sons in, into thugs or your daughters into hoes. Was that the and demon the being? <laughs> Let's look at the stats. I've got the facts. My money like Lizzo. My pockets are fat. Homie, I'm epic. Don't be a whap. Dog, it's a yarmulke. Homie, no cap. Look at the grass. Look at my charts. You're blowing money on strippers and cars. You go into prison. I'm on television. Dog, no one knows who you are. Did you hear the yarmulke are. line? That was, on me on that was the actually kind of good. What was it? I'm not really... Dog, it's a yarmulke. Homie, no cap. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Did you hear, homie, I'm epic. Don't be a whap. What? Yeah, that I don't understand. He said he's epic. He's Ooh. doubling down on the I don't the... like wet ass p word. Mm. Let's look at the stats. I've got the facts. My money like Lizzo. My pockets are fat. That's a true brag. He's rich. Homie, I'm epic. That's a little corny. <laughs> Homie, the... I'm epic. Don't be a whap. A wet ass pussy. Mm-hmm. Dog, my yamaka. Homie, no cap. Look at the graph. Look at my charts. You're blowing money on strippers and cars. You're going to prison. I'm on television. You're Dog, not. No one knows who you are. Why, did, Ben? You are not on you television. You are a YouTuber. <laughs> who do you think is this person? He's like he, addressing here. He, uh, I don't know. Like uh, yeah, Ethan, his haters. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't know. I, yeah, a, like a group of like angry like white uh, BLM supporters. I don't know. Or like BLM, blue like, haired. Yeah. That that's what they imagine. Right. But they're like also rich. They're spending money on strippers and cars. That that they are definitely not. That's a confusion of. <laughs> that's his, a of very his, confusing. Yeah. Who is this person? This is not. <laughs> good point. No, they're not doing that for sure. Mm-hmm. My comment section all woke Karens, and I make racks off compound interest. Y'all live with your parents. Nikki, take some notes. I just did this for fun. All my people. Download this. Let's get a billboard number one. Okay, so that part oh. right there is probably one of the corniest, lamest. <laughs> the whole. That's so um, um, everyday, bro. Right. 
<laughs> All my people download this. Let's get a billboard number one. <laughs> <laughs> that I that I can't abide by. Yeah. I love that he's trying to do this uh, Eminem thing with his outfit, but he looks more like E.T. when they're trying to hide him. <laughs> <laughs> put him in a big oversized hoodie. Right. Yeah. You could tell he, this is pro his first time wearing it. I just the way it's creased and stuff. Yeah. I feel like it just was folded up. <laughs> no steamer on set. Right. Come on now. Come on. Look at my charts. You're blowing money on strippers and cars. You go into prison. I'm on television. Dogs. No one knows who you are. Oh. Keep hating on me on the internet. My comment section all woke Karens. And I make racks off compound interest. Y'all live with your parents. Nikki, take some notes. I just did this for fun. All my people download this. Let's get a billboard number one. That's Let's unforgivable. Get a billboard number one. That, that's just Ooh. unforgivable. On, it's like Disney. You, you, come on. <laughs> so embarrassing. We ain't selling drugs. We ain't gonna overdose. That's the end of the band, by the way. We won't turn your sons into thugs or your daughters into hoes. I don't care if I offend. Yo! I was playing. Take a map and drive on. Yeah. Oh! Oh! Yeah. Very Again, like <laughs> he loves these people like Ben Shapiro. If Ben Shapiro saw this guy in the street, he would mad judge him. He'd cross the street. Yeah. <laughs> well, most people would probably, but <laughs> but like you're you want to be a part of the crew, but you want to dress and look like the people that you're making fun of. And but again, the people you're trying to be friends with would judge you hard if they ever saw you on the street. So I just don't get it. Grift. It's a grift. Mm -hmm. It's a cringe. <laughs> it's a major cringe. You need to make a, a, a response to this track. <laughs> if I offend you, <laughs> sorry I offended you. I love how they're always like with the offense, like, sorry you triggered, like we're still on the whole that whole wave yeah. of like, I'm sorry I'm so offensive. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Also, I'm going to rap about how I don't do drugs <laughs> and I don't Go to strip bars. Like, wow. <laughs> and really hoes, edgy, by dude. the way. Hoes. We don't like hoes around here. Right. Wow, you're such a... You're so counterculture, man. No so hoes. Cool. <laughs> mm. Man is locked up. <laughs> what, what's the, what was that shot? What was that shot? <laughs> Why did they include that? <laughs> Was that like supposed to be like flirty? <laughs> Look at that. It was like a Herman yeah. Cain thing. Yeah, exactly. Coming up. <laughs> this. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> Why did this do that? I think it's, yeah, I think it's a, like um, sexy. He's trying he's, to riz you. He's risen right there. Sorry if I rizzed you. <laughs> Here, I can do it in slow motion. Here he is. Feast your eyes, uh -huh. ladies and men, whoever, anyone. Uh, <laughs> of, your, of, your booty hole. <laughs> of your booty hole. Did I do that? Uh, oh shit, this is a crispy 4K. <laughs> wow. Gorge. Let's see. Of your booty hole. Thank you. <laughs> I'm the man, I'm the man who don't respect you. You mad, you mad. Nope. Oh, I guess it's cool to be the victim. Well, I'm a beat em man. You said, you said, you said. <laughs> you just try to get attention, being triggered's all you have. You mad, they said you mad, it. They said the word trigger. You blame everybody else for every problem that you can. Who are you talking you to, bro? You like, made a whole song about whatever this is, so. <laughs> bro, Who's mad? <laughs> this is between you and your therapist. I don't know what's going on here. Oh, my Hogs. This is this is childhood trauma. Hog life. Bad. Oh, ChatGPT wrote me a response. <laughs> so here's my comeback with Flo So Divine, challenging Ben Shapiro line by line. I'll bring the truth and rhythm and rhyme. Win back my sponsors. It's just a matter of time. So listen up, sponsors. If you're out there still, I've got more to say. Got a void to fill. With beats and bars, I'll climb that hill. Because losing you, man, it's been real. Fucking uh, bars. Not the best. That wasn't that good. Didn't really stick the ending there. Also was like just about me losing sponsors. <laughs> <laughs> I not. said right. <laughs> right this, right yeah. a, this track about Ben Shapiro making me lose my sponsors. Uh, oh, I guess they, he kind of missed the mark yeah. a little bit. Missed the mark on that one. Good flow though. That was a 3.5 I could tell. 
<laughs> yeah, for sure. All right. You said, you said, I will never say I'm sorry. I ain't taking nothing back. I don't care if I offend you. You haven't really said anything offensive in the song. You can cry and you can scream. You can ride in the street. This whole song is like to his parents. <laughs> no, I'm cool. <laughs> like, I don't care if I offend you. I'm not taking it back. I'm like, no, I'm good. It's fine. It's, yeah. Take, Maybe take, back. take the song back. I mean, yeah. Take, yeah. That, that's more for him than anyone else, though. Right. You gotta unpublish this quick. <laughs> <laughs> Genuinely, who's listening to this? Yeah. Because I know anyone that actually cares about hip hop would never fucking quit this dude. It's ever. gotta be mostly people like us that are like just think it's funny. No, there's no way he's getting that many views. They call me a like, look at this shit. 30. There's no way. Do you think there are Ben Shapiro kids out there that would enjoy it? I find it hard to believe if somebody liked this type of music, they would listen to like actual talented hip-hop artists and not this so that's why i'm thinking it's got to be like weird maga country guys who are like i like hip-hop when it's not about drugs mm. and hoes yeah <laughs> this this kind of hip-hop ain't bad i could listen to this one yeehaw okay let's go to his most popular 42 million fake woke let's see what the comments are 38 million mm. Here's some of his merch. <laughs> Hi, I'm the toxic male that the snowflakes warned you about. Oh, fuck me. Holy shit. Dude, that shirt will get you so much ass. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Hmm. Very cool. So let me read some of the comments. Sure. Feelings aren't facts. It's one of the most valuable things I learned in therapy. What? I just discovered your song today, and holy sweet Moses, my guy. I'm actually at a loss for words at how accurate, relevant, and brutally honest and outright creative you are. You are living proof that the rap genre is not only still alive, it's thriving. No drug glorification, no promiscuity, mm. no gross lyrics, no Indeed. fat stacks of money, just honest-to-God truth with insanely dope melodies. Well said. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There are people out there. Uh, there's, I enjoy this. I gotta know who. Karate that. Girl 999 knows <laughs> hip hop. Dude, I feel like it's just all Russian bots trying to like ruin America. <laughs> <laughs> I'm convinced though, right? That would make more sense. Yeah. Uh, somebody in the chat said my ex loved this shit. It was awful. So okay. there's some real fans out there, I guess. All right. How long have we been going? Uh, three and a half. We're right there it on is. Time. My spidey senses are tingling. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Do we should we read some more donos real quick? Uh, real quick. Here. Thank you, everybody, so much for the uh, the members and the donos. Appreciate that. You moved everything you already read. Yep. Uh. Somebody, Julia, donated 10 bucks and said, for more sketches, you guys kill me. There will be more <laughs> sketches. That's part yeah. of why we shifted the schedule around with uh, See You next Thursday. Um, because Tuesday is a better day for us to all get together and shoot stuff for the show. So, uh, theoretically, that will uh, continue um, for the indefinite future here. I'm glad uh, to have the uh, day where it's not punch time now. Yeah, yeah Cam, Cam needs more time to work his magic on our... Mm. Good job on acting, edit, by the way. Yeah, great yeah. job. Hey, great job on writing it, Ian. Hey, Ian's great job. Concept. Yeah, it's all good. All around. Director good. Ian. Uh, thank you for reading my comment. Now it's on the record so my friends can't steal it. Oh, I think that was one of the name suggestions earlier. Also, I'm naming my kid Mud, so please read so it's on the rest record. You're naming Ooh. your kid Mud? Insane. Big Primus fan, dude. My name my is Mud. What is this comment? Oh, I'm a bam, fan bam, of bam, H3. Bam. Tom and Ben. Oh, this guy? Oh, this person says she's a fan of H3, Tom, and Ben. What? Wow. Each How? one of you has good content that I enjoy watching. Wow. You're wow. a unicorn. That is a unicorn. <laughs> you are like, you have transcended. You are like huh. a person of the people, man. Holy smokes. <laughs> uh, oh, Bruce, Teddy, Sonny, BTS, BTS, BTS. Be careful. <laughs> 
They said they're warning you. Why? Yeah. I'm, Why? That's well, right. because Theodore and Sunny. Because that's a lot to live up to. <laughs> that's a lot to live no, up to. No, I'm not to. trying to live up to them, Dan. Yeah. I'm just paying homage. <laughs> homage. Homage. Uh, uh, Miranda donated ten dollars and gave a long list of baby name suggestions. Um, Too late. I'm sorry. The name has been locked in. <laughs> uh, I'll read them off just to read them off. Jasper, Roscoe, Jasper, Jasper. <laughs> You want to submit that one now? Late entry? <laughs> Jasper. Uh, Roscoe. Perry. Percy. These are all very good, like, kind of old, old names. Mm -hmm. Percy. Franklin. Leo. Fletcher. Oscar. Archer. Kind of like Archer. Samson. Gideon. Vincent. And Donovan. Don wow. Donovan's a nice one. Some good suggestions in there. Donnie. Uh, they will not be used, though, because the kid's name is Tony. <laughs> Check this out. Me waking up. My mom at 3 a.m. because I threw up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's good. It's a fact. It's a Yamaka, homie, no cap. Look at the grass. Look at my charts. You're blowing money on strippers mm. and cars. You go into prison. I'm on television. Dogs, no one knows who you are. Keep By the way, on. amongst Hasidic Jews, apparently prostitution is a huge problem. I've mm. heard in Israel. So Really? Just mm -hmm. saying. Huh. Is that what the tunnels were for? That's what the tunnels <laughs> were for, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, apparently, uh, I don't, I've watched a documentary, I've heard from people that the prostitutes say that Hasids are like a ton of their clientele. Well, also because you're not allowed to be gay, so there is... I think, yeah. You know. Okay. A lot of stuff going underground. Interesting. That's probably true. Um, here's an important one. $50 donation from Cecilia. The people of Hawaii would see throwing or even dipping a Stanley Cup in their volcano as a huge sign of disrespect of their land and culture. Mm -hmm. I live on Kauai and I just wanted to state mm -hmm. with peace and love so you guys don't get canceled. LOL. Mm -hmm. Love you guys. Yeah. That was why I was kind of hesitant when we were talking about it because I, I know yeah. that there's stuff around that, that. The tour guide gave us the mm. thumbs up. Sounds like Iceland. Well, that's a, Iceland might be the way to go, which I'm not complaining about a trip to Iceland. <laughs> I'd, go to, I'd go to Iceland. It's, well, it's I'd go to Iceland for this. Iceland might be cheaper for me because you probably won't want to stay there as long. I mean, it's eternal darkness right now. <laughs> that's true. And it's freezing. That's true. It's probably very fucking cold. Uh, I've always wanted to go, though, so. What's the temperature? Just saying. What's the? Just have, what's their big town there? Reykjavik. Reykjavik. Iceland weather report. Mm -hmm. it's, it's probably Reyk not too Reykjavik. cold. Reykjavik. You don't think so? That's well, it's probably the middle of the night there right now. That'd be freezing. Yeah, that'd be pretty cool. It's, it's currently minus two. That's not bad. Way. Minus two? Celsius, tw uh, 28 yeah. degrees Fahrenheit. I went oh. in June, and around that time, you have a pretty, like, normal daytime, nighttime <clears throat> So on these cycle. Days, so just in Fahrenheit, I'll, I'll say, the, high, the highest high of the week is 29. I Did mean, you talk anymore, that's please? fine. It is? It's like For New York, winter, that's, that's below so freezing. Like I was just in Idaho and it was that cold, so it's not too extreme. Iceland is not that far north, so it won't it won't be too dark on the winter. What either. the hell are you talking about? It's not like I'm looking at it. It's <laughs> not, pretty fucking north. It's comparison to Sweden. It's like you're gonna have a a decent hour, like night. Okay, okay. all right, all right. You Wait, you are from yeah. that region, hold on. so hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me look at world map because that's confusing to me. I mean, it's about halfway up in latitude from. It's I guess much there's where places in Sweden that are higher. It's up there. It's, it's getting the up as there. My city. Where do you live? In the north? No, just just at level with Iceland, pretty much. Oh, exactly. you live in? He's like mid. Yeah. A little bit further down. Yeah. Interesting. Okay. Well, then you mm. would know. If you wanna, you should go to Svalbard. If you want pure mm. night. It's the island. Svalbard? It's oh, the, island the Norway Oversea. island up there? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm, well, I'll pass on that one. <laughs> Do people live there? Yeah. Wow. They're mostly researchers, though. Yeah, okay. that's But it, it, there's civilians living there, too. Svalbard. Wow. Um, all right. We should, uh, we should wrap it up. It's getting late. Thank you, everybody. It's been fun. It's been great. And a uh, shout out to Jason, who is the proud recipient of uh, five. So <laughs> galaxies, two watermelons, and seven uh, GG's hearts. <laughs> and um, 
um, that's about it. Thank you, everyone, for your support. Thank you to all of our members. Thank you to everyone who's watching. It's all appreciated. And I hope you all have a great weekend. And um, we'll see you guys on Monday. So, ta-ta. Have a good weekend. That I could step into yours instead You are so close but I'm on my own Cause I just don't know